so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! And look at where we're at! Yeah. Today we're at Garish Swim Club in Pasadena, California! Wow, I love this place! Yeah, it's a place where you can go swimming! Do you like to swim? Swimming is so much fun! <laughs> Whoa! What's this? Check it out! Wonder what's inside! Whoa! Whoa! A heart! Ah! <sighs> I wonder what it says. Oh, dear best friend, it's Valentine's Day. So come on, let's celebrate, dance, and play. Being your best friend is really cool. Come check out the surprise on the other side of the pool. Wow, that is awesome. I wonder what the surprise is. <laughs> let's go. Oh, look, pretty hearts. Wow, there's so many of them. Wow, there's all these hearts here, probably because it's Valentine's Day. Whoa! Okay, let's go find the surprise. Whoa, more hearts. Wow, oh, check it out. Whoa, hello heart. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, and look at this one. Whoa! It's a heart made out of hearts! Whoa! <laughs> this is awesome! <laughs> huh. I wonder where the surprise is! Oh, look at this! Whoa, it's like I'm a lifeguard! Hello! Whoa! <laughs> Do you see who it is? Yeah, it's Mika! Let's go say hi! So nice yeah. sounding. <gasps> Wait a second. Was it you that left all those hearts there for me? Yes, it was. Oh. Because you are my best friend and today is Valentine's Day. Oh. <laughs> well, you are my best friend and I love Valentine's Day. Me too. It's a great day to recognize and celebrate those that you love and really care about. Oh, well, I love being your best friend and I love that you are my best friend. Yeah, me too. And I love hanging out. Oh, thanks, Mika. Hey, let's play a game right now. Really? What game? Let's play Heart and Seek. Heart and Seek? Mm -hmm. Kind of sounds like hide and seek. That's right. So we have to find hearts all around, like these glasses right here. Oh, so <laughs> fabulous. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> all right, let's go. All right, come on. Woo yeah, a little game of Heart and Seek. Whoa! This one was pretty easy to find because <laughs> it's such a big heart. Wow, I love Valentine's Day. And I bet you can guess if this is gonna sink or float. <laughs> yeah, okay, let's see. What else can we find here? Oh, check it out. Whoa! Wow, another heart. Yeah. Whoa, it's really heavy but there is some air inside. I'm so excited to see if it's gonna sink or float. <laughs> this is not in the shape of a heart, but that's okay. Yeah, looks like a steering wheel. Whoa! Maybe it's a steering wheel for a tractor. Whoa! Or a sports car. Whoa! All right, let's see if this will sink or float. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Look at all the items on the table. Maybe we can throw these in the pool and see if they'll sink or float. Okay, it looks like a mug. That's yeah, pretty heavy, but there is some air inside. Ooh, looks like some princess wands. Wow. Okay, let me put those right in there. <laughs> Whoa! And a jump rope. Whoa! It's pretty light. Huh, but it might also sink. I don't know, I'm so excited to find out. Oh, but look at this. 
Wow, a cute unicorn backpack. Wow. Woo, woo. <laughs> That's gonna be fun to see if they'll sink or float. <laughs> Whoa, cool, a playground. Whoa, wait a second. Do you see something right there? Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Look at what we found! Wow! A cute teddy bear! Look at what it says! I love you! Wow! Yeah! On the lifeguard stand, we have some more things. We have... Whoa! Some blue and orange rings! Hmm! Oh! Also looks like... We have a water bottle. Whoa! And we have some water toys. Oh. All right. Okay, let's go see if these will sink or float. <laughs> yes! I am so excited to find heart shaped things for heart and seek. Ooh! I see a really big heart right here. Check it out! I bet you can guess if this is going to sink or float. This is a heart-shaped float. Ooh, so relaxing. Let's keep looking. Mm. Oh, look how cute. A teddy bear. But a teddy bear is not shaped like a heart. Hmm. Oh, look, do you see? There are two adorable hearts right there. Oh, so cute. All right, come on. This, this. What else can we find? Oh, my goodness, it's a microphone. And what? Hey, here's some hearts. This looks like a really cute headband. Ooh, what do you think? Hello, hello, hello. Happy Valentine's Day. Follow me, we'll find some fun things for sink or float or with my best friend, Billy B. Hey! There's more things over here, come look. Ooh, do you see any hearts on this? I see one, two hearts, and Here. 
Oh, look at these rings. Not heart shaped, they are circles. Okay, we have a lot of fun things. I can't wait to find Flippy and play our next game. Come on! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, Mika, you got so many items! Yeah, so did you, Flippy. Look at all that! I know! Hey, let's set this down. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! Oh. Whoa! <laughs> oh. Alright! Oh Whoa! That's a lot of stuff! I know, check it out! <laughs> wow! Hey. Did you find any hearts? Yeah, I did! And it looks like we got some of the same things! Yeah! Like our big floaty heart. Yeah! Oh, that yeah. was such a fun game it of really heart was. and seek! Yep! Whoa! But hey, since some of these are really heavy and yeah. some are light and some are big and small, yeah. I was actually thinking we could play a game! I was thinking the same thing! Really? What game? I was thinking we could play... Sink or Float! float. Yeah! <laughs> Okay, so many items. Do you yeah. want to start or me? Um, you go ahead. Okay, all right. I'm gonna start with the big heart. Do you want to oh, throw yours in at yeah, the same let's time? Do it. All right, Ready? here we go. Sink or float? Whoa! Oh. Yeah. Oh, they're floating. Yeah, we knew that one was yeah, coming. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see. Um, check this out. Ooh. I found a orange and blue ring. Flippy, I have rings too. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Shall we throw them in at the same time? Yeah, ready? All right. Three, Three two, two, one. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, look, they're going down. Oh, yeah. They're sinking. They're sinking. Oh, those must be dive rings. You're right. Yeah, so cool. You can throw them in the pool, hold your breath, dive down and grab them. Yeah, what a fun game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you found a steering wheel. I know, it's so cool just grabbing hold of it and acting like I'm racing the car. Yeah. Re -re 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 -re. You want to try? <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 Oh, careful, Mika. <laughs> whoa. All right. Can I throw it in? Yeah, go for it. All right. Here we go. Whoa. Cool. It sinks. Yeah. <laughs> that was so much fun throwing yeah. some of these items in to see if they sink or float. Hey, I wonder if we can find another place to play sink or float because we have more items. Oh, yeah. That's a great idea. Let's grab them and go. Let's do it. <laughs> Oh, wow. look at that! Yeah, that looks so fun! Yeah, this looks like a perfect place to finish sink or float! Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Let's see what we All have right. here. Woohoo! All right, remember this heart from earlier? Yeah. Yeah. You want to see what's inside? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, a rock! Yeah. Yeah, I bet you'll know what will happen with this. <laughs> It'll probably sink. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> yep. All right, what about this box? Here we go. Oh, whoa! It it's, floats. Yeah. <laughs> it's really light wood. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey, what about this friend? Wow, yeah. Okay. This soft <laughs> cuddly bear. Ready to go for a swim? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Woohoo! Oh. Whoa! <laughs> he <laughs> loves swimming. <laughs> All right. Oh! Snuggly bear I found. Oh, it's so cute. I love you. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Woo! Oh, wow! Oh, too. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Ooh, do you want to throw the backpack that I found in? Sure, I love this backpack. It's so shiny. Yeah. Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right. Woohoo! Wow! It floats. That one floats too. <laughs> wow, so many of these things are floating right now. Oh, let's see. Hey, you found two balls? Yeah. Oh, and I found one ball. Wow. Whoa. 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 <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> All right. Here, let's just throw these two in. Okay. <laughs> here we go. Whoa. They float too. Wow. Oh, here it is. Can we find <laughs> anything that stinks? I don't know. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe we should do rapid fire. Oh, let's do it. All right. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Okay. Float. Whoa! Whoa! Sink! <laughs> oh, my brush. Whoa! Whoa! Ooh! 
some of the wands you found. Yeah, and some of the wands that you found. All right. Whoa. <laughs> oh, what a pretty necklace. Wow. A heart? Whoa, did you look inside? I did. And I'm there's nothing. Oh, <laughs> so silly. <laughs> All right, here we go. Sinks. And this really fun jump rope. <laughs> Float. And last but not least, here we go! Oh, and Flippy, I forgot! My very special Heart Valentine headband. Oh, yeah! Should we see if it sinks or floats? I would love that. All right! Whoa! It floats! Yeah! <laughs> that was so much fun playing Heart and Seek with you, Mika! Yeah, and playing Seek or Float. <laughs> yeah! I'd love sink or float and it was such a fun valentine's day with you yeah i had so much fun with you baby oh thanks i'm so curious if i sink or float oh that is a great idea well good thing you're a really good swimmer yeah and there's a lifeguard oh. hey <laughs> all right i'll be right back oh i can't <laughs> wait have fun! Oh, I can't wait! Go, Flippy! swimming and I love Valentine's Day. Me too. I had so much fun playing with you. You're my best friend, Blippi. Oh, Mika, you're my best friend. Aww. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Yeah. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Flippy. Good job. And if you want to see videos with me in them, you can search for my name too. Will you spell my name with me? Okay. Yeah. It's M-E-E-K-A. -E <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Triple Play Family Fun Park in Hayden, Idaho. Oh, I'm so excited to be here. <gasps> What's that sound? Oh my goodness! Look! It's a dinosaur! Whoa! Are you a Velociraptor? Whoa! Wait! I heard about you! Are you Stanley? Can you show me some fun things to do inside Triple Play? Awesome! Come on! Whoa, there's water. Yeah. Oh, Stanley, you know those dinosaurs over there? Ah, oh, hi, I'm Mika. <laughs> Whoa. Stanley, you're so nice to show me around. I love dinosaurs. <gasps> we should all act like dinosaurs. Can you help us? Okay, awesome. What's something a dinosaur does? Oh yeah, stomp! Stomp, stomp, stomp like a dinosaur. Ooh, what's something else dinosaurs do? Oh yeah, they have really big and mighty roars. Let's roar together, ready? Roar! Whoa, Stanley, I don't know if I could roar as loud as you. <laughs> what's something else that dinosaurs do? What? Dinosaurs dance? I didn't know that. Let's all dance together. Yeah, you got the move, Stanley. Okay. All right. <laughs> Aw, it was so nice meeting you, Stanley. Thanks for showing us how to be dinosaurs and taking us to this really cool space. I'll see you next time, buddy. Bye. <gasps> Whoa. Did you see how big his tail is? Stanley's so cool. I wonder what else is in here. Whoa! This place is really 
really cool. I've never been in a space like this before. There's a huge pool. Whoa, look at this. It's a raft. Do you know what shape this is? It's a circle. <laughs> and do you know what color it is? That's right, it's the color red. Good color. Already? Oh, <gasps> let's get a closer look at Stanley's friends. Come on. Okay, let's sneak up on Stanley's friends. Hello. <laughs> oh, hi, nice to meet you. My name is Mika. Look, can you see their teeth? They have way more teeth than we do. And they're so, so sharp. They're carnivores. That means they like to eat meat. Whoa. These are velociraptors and they run really, really fast on their legs. Whoa, look how big and sharp that talon is. Whoa, can you imagine if you had those on your toes? It would be really hard to wear sneakers if your toenails were like that. <laughs> Let's keep exploring. Whoa! <laughs> Look at this! It's like a water playground. They call it the Children's Lagoon here. Oh! Look at that yellow slide! That would be so fun because you can land in the water and get all wet. <laughs> wow! Whoa! See how the floor is painted different colors? I see yellow, there's blue, oh, and all the way back there is red. It makes the water look like it's different colors. <laughs> Whoa, looks like you can walk up a net, go up the yellow stairs, and there's more water slides. This place is so cool. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, there's another fountain. Wow. There's water all over this. I think you would need a swimsuit to play on that playground. <laughs> Whoa, look over here. Dinosaur footprints. Whoa, do you think Stanley made those or another dinosaur? Hmm. Here's another one. Whoa, look how much bigger it is than my foot. Whoa, wow. Oh, come here. Wow, this is an actual mold of a real dinosaur fossil. Do you know what kind of dinosaur it is? It's a velociraptor. <laughs> We've seen a lot of those today. Whoa. Look at its mouth. You can see its sharp teeth in there. Velociraptors lived 150 million years ago. <laughs> Whoa. Is it snack? These are the ribs. We have ribs on our sides. <laughs> wow. Whoa, look at the tail. Even the tail has bones in it. Wow. <laughs> Velociraptors are really cool and really ferocious and strong and super fast. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> More dinosaur footprints. Let's see where they take us. Oh, look at this. A crate of objects. Hmm. And we're by a giant pool. <gasps> That only means one thing. We should play sink or float. <laughs> Will you play sink or float with me? Awesome, let's do it. All right, let's see what we have in the crate. We have a blue bouncy ball. Ooh. <laughs> will it sink or will it float? We won't know until we throw. It's floating. <laughs> And we have a, ooh, a spatula. Maybe you've seen these in your kitchen. You can make pancakes. Ooh, do you think it will sink or float? Let's see. 
Whoa! It went to the bottom, but the handle is sticking up. It sunk. All right. Will it sink or will it float? Wow, this is a really cool cup. I love these colors. Oh, I love it. But will it sink or float? Okay, what else do we have in here? Whoa, here's a fun truck. Vroom, 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 vroom. Whoa, nice and yellow. One of my favorite colors. Huh, I wonder if this will sink or float. Only one way to find out. Huh. It floats. <laughs> Whoa, look at these. Hello. Whoa, I can see you way here now. <laughs> Let's see, will these silly glasses sink or float? It looks like they're sinking, wow. I totally thought they were going to float. <laughs> All right, what else is in here? Oh yeah, another Velociraptor. <laughs> will you sink or will you float? We won't know until we throw! That dinosaur is definitely floating. All right. Hmm. Whoa! Hey! This is a ruler. You can use it to measure things. I wonder if it will sink or float. Whoa. It's sinking! <laughs> Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. Should we see if the rest will sink or float and one big dump? <laughs> Let's do it. One, two, three, Whoa! Wow, I see some diving sticks that sunk to the bottom and everything else is floating away, goodbye! Ha. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> awesome. <gasps> Let's spell it in the pool. Okay, ready? M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, thank you so much for having a good time with me today in this super cool place filled with Velociraptors. I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy. Hi, and I'm Mika, and we are at Adventure City in Anaheim, California. Yeah, and at this place, they have a lot of fun rides. Yes, and I love going on rides. <laughs> me too. Have you ever been on a ride before? Yeah, no. let's go. Come on. are you most excited for? Oh, oh, I hope they have a carousel. <laughs> oh, cool, yeah, with all those horses. Yeah, what about you? Uh, maybe a roller coaster. Whoa. Yeah. Wait, what's that sound? Oh, no. Whoa, cool, a, a train. train. Wow. 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 This looks like this could be our very first ride. Yeah, let's do it. Whoa, all right. Here, Here you are, go. Blippi. Oh, thank you. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, I like this train. It's the color red. Yeah, and I like this big green stripe that goes across. Oh yeah, and the two yellow stripes. Mm -hmm, they're <laughs> nice. And what do we say? All aboard! <laughs> Whoa, wow. this is so cool. Yeah. Choo choo! <laughs> what a fun way to see the park. I'm oh. so 
excited to ride all these rides. Me too, and Blippi, I think I found your roller coaster. Whoa, cool! <laughs> A roller coaster! Whoa! It's orange and yellow. Hey. I'm definitely gonna ride that one You later. love orange. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> Ooh, we're in a tunnel. It's like we're in a mining cave. Yeah, this is awesome. And look, water, a waterfall. Oh, oh that looks so refreshing. Yeah, it's really <laughs> pretty here. Oh, Whoa. where are we now? Oh, it looks like the jungle. Oh, cool. Cool. We've arrived! Yeah! Wow, what a fun ride that was! It really was! Oh! Alright! Here we are! <laughs> well, okay. shall we go see what other rides they have here? Yeah, I can't wait to see which one we're gonna go on next! Alright, let's go! Okay, here you go! Thank you! <laughs> ride is the Giggle Wheel. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, shall we ride it? Yeah, let's do it. All right. Hmm. Whoa, would you like to go first or me? Oh, I'll get in first if you don't mind. All right. <laughs> Whoa, thank you. All right, buckle up. Thank you. Whoa. Thank you very much. Woohoo! All right. Thank you. All right, I'm buckled up. Here I come, Mika. <laughs> now you're going up high. Yeah, and you're down low. <laughs> So much fun! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Check it out, Mika! Yeah, a carousel! Let's go! Alright! Wow! Whoa! <laughs> looks like so much fun! Yeah, I love all these different kinds of horses! Yeah! It just started! That means we can go now. Yes, let's go. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Ready to ride the carousel? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. All right. All right. Mm, let's see. Here we go. Whoa. Cool. There's so many different colors to choose from. Yeah. This I one. really like this one. Really? I like this purple and this blue here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And yellow and green. Yeah, I love all of these colors so much. Yeah, and I love horses. You do? Do yeah. you know what sound a horse makes? I do, I okay, do. Okay, show them. Nay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's <was> very good. <laughs> Nay. Nay. <laughs> okay, so is this the one that you want to ride? I think so. Okay, <laughs> and let's see. Maybe I'll ride this one. Oh, yeah. Whoa, check it out, Mika. Whoa. Yeah. This horse is black. Yeah. And look at the bright green right there on the saddle. Yeah. Whoa, and it even has gold and red. Yeah. Whoa, I'm so excited. This is a very cool looking horse, Blippi. Great choice. <laughs> Thanks. Well, shall we? Let's do it. <laughs> First, we have to buckle up for safety. That's right. All right. All right, <laughs> buckle in. Me too. All right, giddy up, horsey. All right, I'll race ya. All right, giddy up. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> yeah! Giddy up, horsey, giddy up. Catch me! Oh, 
It's like we're riding horses in the countryside. Oh, I love it. Wind blowing through our hair, That's fresh right. air. We have fun. Yeah, we do. <laughs> Yeehaw! Yeah! Look yeah. at that! Woohoo! Get in, Porcy! Whoa! I think the ride's over, Mika. Yeah, I think so too. That was fun. That was a lot of fun. Yep. Well, since it's over, do you want to see what other rides they have? Yeah, let's check it out. All right. Okay. Okay. Here we go. go. All right. See you later. Have a good day. <laughs> Wow, a lot of mist. Wow, mist? Yeah. Mist, that's just really teeny, teeny, tiny particles of water. Well, well, what do we do? You want to go inside? Yeah. Yeah, come on. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. All right, here we go. Whoa. 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 Where are you? Whoa. Whoa. is the freeway coaster. Wow. All right. This one is the color purple. Ooh, a black cart. Oh, a blue cart. A red cart. And the last cart, a yellow cart. Hmm, what cart should we ride? Huh. Hey, how about the blue cart? Yeah, it's one of my two favorite colors. You knew that already, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Here we go. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> He's just making sure everything is nice and safe, and he made sure this is tight. Woohoo! I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, here we go! Yeah! inside the coop. Let's see. It says it's 25 cents and I have a quarter. <laughs> All right, let's see. Whoa, look. It brought out some food for the chickens. All right, chickens, are you hungry? Here you go. Here's a yummy snack for you. <laughs> That chicken looks really hungry. Eat up. Snack time. It looks like it's some dried corn. Nice and healthy. Oh, you want a little bit more? Here you go. Wow. 
there's so many different kinds of chickens in here. Like a white one. That one looks black and has some orange feathers in there. Wow. Nice to meet you, chickens. What other animal friends are here? Hmm. Let's go look. Bye, chickens. Nice meeting you. Let's see if there are more animals here. Come on. Whoa, goats. Hi, goat. I'm Mika. Oh, look. There's some snacks for the goat. Oh, here you go. Oh, this goat's really hungry. <laughs> Oh, look, it's in an ice cream cone. I didn't know goats like ice cream cones. <laughs> Let's go inside and hang out with them. Come on. It says, enter. I guess we can. Oh, take this little brush with us. Hi, goats. Hi. Who wants a nice brush? Come on over. Come on. Come on over. Whoop. Hmm. Maybe they don't want to get brushed. Sometimes I don't like to get my hair brushed either. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, it's so nice. It's so soft. It's really good to take care of animals. See how nice its hair looks? Oh, hi. Oh, you want some love too? I'll brush you so you look nice and clean. Aw, this is so cool. You can ride rides and hang out with animals. This place is amazing. I wonder if Blippi went on the big roller coaster. Let's find out. <laughs> Bye, goats. Thanks for hanging out with me. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, Mika. Hey, Blippi. Oh, how was your time? Oh, it was really fun. Super cute goats. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Yeah. I gotta ride the freeway coaster. Whoa, did you like it? Yeah, it was really intense. Oh, I'm glad <laughs> that you liked it. Oh, thanks, Mika. Well, shall we hop back on the train? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, there it is. Cool. <laughs> Did you like all these rides? Awesome. Yeah! Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with us? Yeah! B-L-I-P-P-I -P -P -I, Flippy. Will you spell my name with me? Great! M-E-E-K-A-H Mika! Yeah! All right, see you again! Today, I'm at the American Museum of Natural History in New York City. Do you know what's inside of this museum? All different kinds of animals and dinosaurs. And I heard
heard that they have one of my favorite dinosaurs, a T-Rex. Do you know what a T-Rex looks like? I have one in my jam pack. Whoa, here it is. <laughs> hey, will you come with me and see if we can find a T-Rex inside? Let's go. Whoa, I'm inside of the museum. I can't wait to find the T-Rex. Whoa, that is definitely not the T-Rex. Do you know what that is? It's a blue whale. Oh, and look, I see a bandage on that whale. <laughs> Even whales get boo-boos. <laughs> Did you know that the blue whale is the biggest animal on the planet? <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> oh, I see someone over there who works at the museum. I bet they have more whale facts. Come on. Hi. Hello. I'm Mika. What's your name? Alexandra. Hi, Alexandra. So I bet you know something about the blue whale. Yes. You do? What do you do here? I'm an educator. Oh, an educator. So yeah, you definitely know. Um, what do blue whales eat? Blue whales eat tiny krill. Whoa. Look at these tiny shrimps. Can you believe a big blue whale likes to eat these tiny little shrimps? <laughs> <laughs> Wow, well, do blue whales have teeth like us? No, they don't have teeth. They have baleen. Baleen? Oh, whoa, feels like straw. Can you imagine if you had straw in your mouth instead of teeth? Ugh, <laughs> so how do they eat? They open up their mouth. Okay. Very, very big. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. They take a cup of water, <gasps> put krill in it. Mm -hmm. Then they push the water out with their tongue. And what's inside? The grill. Mm. Mm. Cool. <laughs> that seems really complicated. That is not how I eat at all. Wow. And what is that? It looks like a big bone. This is a part of the well vertebrae. The vertebrae. Well, mm. we have those. You can yeah. feel it in your back. Yeah. Can I hold it? Yes, sure. Whoa. Oh, this is so heavy. Look how big this is. Ours are so tiny. Blue whales are huge. <laughs> okay, here, I'll give that back to you. you. Wow, well, thanks for sharing those facts with us. I'm gonna keep exploring, but maybe I'll see you later. See you later. All right, awesome, <laughs> come on. Where is the T-Rex? Where, where is the T-Rex? Whoa. That is not the T-Rex, but it is a very large mammal. Do you know what it is? It's a walrus. <laughs> Not a real walrus, this is just a model. But this looks pretty much exactly like a real walrus. Whoa, do you see those big tusks? They're made out of ivory and they're really strong and really sharp. And that one looks like the size of my arm, maybe even bigger. Look, can you imagine if you had something that big hanging out of your mouth? Could you even find a toothpick big enough to clean that thing? <laughs> They can use them when they're in the water to poke into the ice and pull their bodies up. Very helpful. <laughs> Will you act like a walrus with me? Okay, get your tusk out. <clears throat> Let's keep looking for the T-Rex. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Walrus out. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Wow, you're so funny. That's why you're my favorite. That is why you are my favorite dinosaur. <laughs> oh, hey. I'm still trying to find the T-Rex, but I don't see any dinosaurs anywhere. <laughs> Let's keep looking over here. Maybe we can find something. <gasps> Whoa, gorillas. <gasps> gorillas are super cool. They're really big, they're really strong, they're hairy. They can stand up tall just like humans. But the male gorilla is 10 times stronger than a human. That's Pretty strong. <laughs> Will you act like a gorilla with me? All right, let me see your muscles. Pound your chest. Let's keep looking for more animals. Whoa, yeah, I feel strong just acting like a gorilla. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. See in the back there? A giraffe. Giraffes are so tall. They can get up to 18 feet tall. That's Really, 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 really tall. And they have super long black tongues. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Do you know what that animal is? That's right, a zebra. 
Zebras are awesome. They have black and white stripes and a group of zebras is called a dazzle. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Check out that dazzle of zebra over there. <laughs> they run super fast and they can run in zigzags. Will you zigzag with me? All right, let's go. Run in zigzag. <laughs> Whoa, elephants are so big, so they have to eat a lot of food. Actually, most of their day is filled with eating. They're herbivores, so they're vegetarians. They don't eat meat. Oh, and look, big tusks, just like those walruses. <laughs> hey, will you act like an elephant with me? Get your trunk out. Ready? <laughs> Maybe you can stomp like an elephant. big cats are lions. I love lions because they have really big roars. Kind of like the T-Rex. <laughs> See that one with the mane, all of the hair? That's a male lion. That's how you know, because it has a mane. The other lions that don't have manes are females. And a group of lions is called a pride. <laughs> I still don't see any dinosaurs though. Will you keep looking with me? All right, come on. Wow, we're in the dinosaur room. There has to be a T-Rex here, right? That means yes. <laughs> Let's keep looking. Oh, there's a dinosaur over there. Ah, oh, long tail, lots of teeth, but that's pretty small. A T-Rex is way bigger than that dinosaur. <laughs> it's almost as little as this toy dinosaur. Hello. <laughs> hmm. Oh, look at this dinosaur. Whoa, it has a long neck. Its head is going back really far. Oh, I wonder if it's a dancing. <laughs> nice moves, but not a T-Rex. Hmm. I can't see the T-Rex anywhere. Do you see a T-Rex? Looks like this, big head, so many teeth, really big talons. <gasps> it's right there, the T-Rex, my favorite dinosaur. <gasps> Whoa, look how big the head is. See those big jaws with tons of teeth? Wow, they're so sharp and there's so many of them. Did you know that the T-Rex could have up to 50 to 60 teeth in its mouth? That's a lot of teeth. <laughs> Whoa, you can see the whole body of the T-Rex. The head, the ribs, the big legs, the big feet. Roar! Roar! <laughs> oh, hello. Hi. Hi, I'm Mika, what's your name? Hi, my name is Alana. Hi, Alana, what do you do here? I'm a museum educator. Whoa, a museum educator, so you must know a lot about dinosaurs. I do. Oh, cool, well, I'm really excited because my favorite dinosaur is the T-Rex. I really like the T-Rex also. Oh yeah? Well, yeah, what's one of the reasons you love the T-Rex? I like the T-Rex because it was one of the biggest predators. Whoa, I know, it's very cool, the T-Rex is Huge, has a really big head and legs and a really big tail. You know, they use that big tail to help them balance. Oh yeah, that's right, because their heads are really heavy, right? Really big heads. Yeah, so the tail helps them balance. Like that. You know what else I like about the T-Rex? What? Look at this big foot here. Whoa, is this a real foot of a T-Rex? This is a model. Okay, okay. But this is like an exact replica. Yeah, you can see how big it was. Whoa, am I allowed to touch it? You can touch it. Okay. Wow, look at these toenails. <laughs> They're so big and pointy. So they had three big toes uh -huh. on their back foot. You know what else I like about the T-Rex? What? How big their teeth were. Oh yeah, they have really big teeth. Look at this. <gasps> Whoa. Look how big this tooth is. This is a model of a real T-Rex tooth. 
Wow, can you imagine if your teeth were this big? Look, is it the shank? <laughs> That's really big. What do you think they might have liked to eat with a tooth this big? Oh, probably meat, yeah. right? They were carnivores. Oh, so they were meat eaters. Cool. Great. And what's this? It looks like a big rock. It is a rock, except it's a very special rock. Oh, why? This is a fossil of a dinosaur bone. A real dinosaur a bone? A real dinosaur bone. Would you like to touch it? Yes, please. It's heavy. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see. Okay. All right. It's a little heavy, but it's a real fossil of a dinosaur bone. That's amazing. And what part of the dinosaur is this? That was from their leg or their thigh bone. Oh, so like down here. Right there. Wow. That's amazing. Thanks for sharing this with me. Yeah. So is the T-Rex the biggest dinosaur? It wasn't the biggest dinosaur, but this museum has a model of one of the biggest dinosaurs. What? Can we see it? You want to go see it? Yeah. Let's go. All right, come on. Wow. Whoa, it's so big. Whoa. It keeps going and going and going. <laughs> this is called a titanosaur. Titanosaur, wow, it's really cool. So the titanosaur family was a group of dinosaurs that were sauropods and herbivores. Oh, I know what a sauropod is. That means it walked on four feet. That's right. Ooh. <laughs> and an herbivore means that it was a plant eater. That's right. Yeah, very neat. Now this titanosaur is over 120 feet long. Whoa, or 37 meters. <laughs> That's and, really long. And it weighed almost as much as 10 elephants. Whoa, 10 elephants. That's very, very heavy. Wow. But you know what's cool about this one? This one was just a juvenile, which means it's kind of like a teenager. Whoa, so it's not even fully grown? It gets bigger than this? It does. Wow, that's incredible. Thank you so much for showing me, th showing me this titanosaur. I had fun with you. I have to go teach a class. Oh, but I'll see you soon. Okay, see ya, thanks again. Wow, what a fun day. We got to see so many cool animals like the big blue whale and walruses and lions. And we got to see my favorite dinosaur of all time, the T-Rex. <laughs> Did you have a fun day? <laughs> Me too. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to have more fun and see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> all right, we'll see you next time. <laughs>
It's so bouncy. Whoa, hey, <laughs> I wonder what's over here. with me? <laughs> okay, let's jump together. See how high you can jump up in the sky. <laughs> Jumping is so fun and it's really good exercise. Did you know there are many animals that like to jump too? <laughs> Will you jump like a kangaroo with me? Okay, jump like a kangaroo. <laughs> What other kinds of animals like to jump? Hmm, can you think of any animals that can jump? Hmm, oh, I know, frogs! Ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> okay, let's be frogs together. Whoa, this is pretty fun, but let's keep exploring. <laughs> Look at me go, <laughs> whoa! Check it out! I'm riding a blue baby chick. It's made out of marshmallow. Whoa! <laughs> Ooh, thanks for the ride. <laughs> Look at where we are. Whoa, we're here at the supermarket. Hmm, I bet there's some tasty food inside. <laughs> Come on, let's go check it out. Whoa, look at this place. <laughs> there are so many cool things to buy and eat here. Yum! <laughs> But first, we need a shopping cart. Okay, <laughs> this will work. Here we go. Ooh, look, some yummy food. Well, we should definitely get some bread. And, whoa, look, this bun has sesame seeds on it. <laughs> Yum! <gasps> definitely want this. And maybe some more bread and a hot dog bun. Yummy! <laughs> oh, and look at this. There are all kinds of canned food, cans like pineapple slices. <laughs> Ooh. Alphabet soup. Whoa, <laughs> it's soup, but with the letters of the alphabet in it. <laughs> oh, and some more cans, corn, and oh, check it out. Tomato sauce. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what we could put tomato sauce on. We'll probably need it though. <laughs> oh, and you don't want to forget fresh vegetables. Yeah, look, we have lettuce and we have spinach. Whoa, <laughs> yum. And, whoa, check it out. Cucumber slices. Hello, hello. <laughs> whoa, we'll save these for later. <laughs> Oh, and look, speaking of tomato sauce, we can put it on pizza. Yeah, that's what we can put that tomato sauce on. Look, this pizza has all kinds of toppings. Mm. Ooh, we should put all the toppings on the pizza. <laughs> oh, and look, these toppings, olives, onions, and green peppers. Yummy, <laughs> here we go. Put all the toppings on the pizza. Oh, oh, this pizza's gonna be so tasty. <laughs> Mushrooms, yum, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, do 
you have a favorite topping you like on your pizza? Woo! <laughs> I like that too. <laughs> but before we eat this pizza, we need to buy all the food we picked out. We can take it to the register. Okay, <laughs> I'll save this for later. <laughs> okay, follow me. Looks like we got a lot of groceries. Okay, <laughs> let's put it on the conveyor belt. When you want to buy food at the supermarket, go to the register. Then there'll be a really nice cashier there to help you. <laughs> Whoa, and it looks like we have a really helpful cashier here. <laughs> Oh, hi there. I'm Cashier Blippi. I'd be happy to help you. Oh, it's very nice to meet you. Thanks for your help. Whoa, it looks like there's a lot of food here. No problem for me. <laughs> awesome. See what I said? Yeah, when you go to the register at a supermarket, there's always a helpful cashier nearby. <laughs> okay, let me bring you up. <laughs> beep. 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 Oh, here you go. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Ooh, let's see what the total comes out to. A lot! Whoa, <laughs> that was awesome. Hmm. But before we eat all the food we got, let's keep exploring. But there's some more fun things to see. <laughs> Come on. Ice cream! Ice cream! <laughs> ice cream for sale! <laughs> Whoa! Would you like some ice cream? Yeah! I'm selling ice cream at my ice cream stand! <laughs> Whoa! We have a lot of flavors! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! There are so many amazing flavors! But before we start eating ice cream <laughs> and sharing ice cream, I think we need to make some ice cream! <laughs> Whoa! There are some ingredients and supplies. Ooh, we have a bowl and a spoon. Wait a minute. <laughs> this bowl looks like an ice cream cone. And this spoon does too. Hmm, wonder if it tastes like one. Nope, it tastes like a spoon. <laughs> but that's okay. Look, we have some ingredients. Yeah, we have some eggs. Woo, woo. <laughs> yeah, some eggs and some milk. Mmm, <laughs> yeah, ooh, and some sugar. Ooh, yeah, some sugar. <laughs> well, looks like we have all the ingredients to make some tasty ice cream. Okay, so first, let's crack some eggs. And then, put in some milk. And, don't want to forget that sweet sugar. <laughs> ooh. Then, you mix it all up. We almost lost an egg. Woo. <laughs> Woo. That was a lot of mixing. Yeah, churning and mixing. It's hard work making ice cream. <laughs> but now we can take this and put it in the freezer. Woo. Then all you have to do is wait, mix it some more, wait, mix it some more so it gets nice and cold. <laughs> well, now that we mixed it, we just need to wait. Okay, here we go. Woo. <laughs> I think it's time. Whoa, our ice cream! Ooh! <laughs> Look, we have made some ice cream and a cone. <laughs> See, we have an ice cream cone and a scoop of tasty ice cream. Mmm! Mmm, vanilla! <laughs> so tasty! Whoa! Hey, I have an idea. Let's make the biggest ice cream cone we can! Whoa! Whoa! Look at our cone! <laughs> it's so wobbly! Yeah, because we have four scoops of ice cream! One, two, three, four! Vanilla, salted caramel, chocolate chip, and strawberry! Whoa! <gasps> it's delicious! <laughs> hey, well look! We have a lot of ice cream here, but we also have different kinds of ice cream. Oh, we'll put this for later. <laughs> oh, there you go. Whoa! Oh, oh, 
Oh, oh, an ice cream cookie sandwich! Yum! <laughs> Two cookies and some ice cream makes a tasty treat. Hmm. Oh, do you know what this is? Hmm. Yeah, it's not ice cream. It's a popsicle! <laughs> Ooh, a tasty purple popsicle. <laughs> yeah, popsicles are great for a sunny day. Oh, and look! <laughs> one for me and one for you! <laughs> Yummy! <laughs> well, I'll save this for later. Ooh. Hey, it's orange! <laughs> one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> well, I'm having a lot of fun eating all this ice cream, but I think I have room for one more scoop. One really big scoop! <laughs> Yum! <laughs> Whoa! It looks like someone needs help! Good thing we're here at the fire station. Come on inside! <laughs> Look at this place! Fire stations are awesome! because it's where the firefighters get ready to put out the fires and save the day. <laughs> and I love fire stations because this is where they park the fire trucks. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Whoa, check it out. It's a little fire truck with a ladder. And a host to put out the fire. Psh, psh. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> and look, it even has some lights and sirens to let everyone know oh, someone needs help from a fire. <laughs> Whoa, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. Whoa! Looks like you and I can get dressed up like a firefighter. <laughs> See? There's a hat. And hmm, ooh, this looks like the firefighter jacket. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. One arm and two arms. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> yeah. Firefighter Flippy is on the job. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> yeah, it's a walkie talkie. Ooh, maybe we can find out if someone needs help. <laughs> firefighter Flippy on the job. Anyone need help from a fire? Whoa, there is someone out there. Come on, we need to go help them. <laughs> Whoa, and good thing we have a fire truck. <laughs> yeah, check it out. It's so shiny. <laughs> okay, come on, let's get inside. We can save the day. I had such a great time with you here at Candyland Indoor Playground. <laughs> I had a lot of fun playing pretend, climbing, jumping, swinging. <laughs> Whoa! It was just so much fun. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -I. Blippi, good job. Well, I'll see you soon, bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa! 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 <laughs>would you like to play a game? Sure, Blippi. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's play a game of I Spy. Yeah. <laughs> hmm, okay, I'll go first. Go I spy it. with my Blippi eye something brown and barky. Ooh. Hey, is it the tree trunk? <laughs> yeah, it's the bark <laughs> on the tree trunk. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And me, Yumika. And today, we're here at Tree People in the Santa Monica Mountains. <laughs> Ooh, we're going on a nature hike. Yeah, and we're having so much fun, enjoying the sunshine, oh, and the fresh air, and the really tall green trees. Oh, okay, it's my turn. Okay. I spy with my Mika eye 
Something big and blue. Oh, something that's big and blue. <laughs> hmm. Do you see something big and blue? <laughs> yeah, that's right, it's the sky. That's right. Oh, hello sky. <laughs> okay, my turn. Go. I spy with my blippy eye something red. Hmm, something red. <gasps> hey, is it this flower? <laughs> yeah, look, it's a red flower <laughs> bud. Aw, yeah. Oh, so pretty. Hasn't bloomed yet. No, not till the spring. <laughs> then it will be a beautiful red flower. What a beautiful day. Blippi, did you know that today is Earth Day? I didn't. Hmm, I wonder, how do you celebrate Earth Day? Let's sing a song and find out. Look at what it's worth to live on planet Earth. It's the place that we call home. Yeah, it's pretty great. With the buzzing of the bees, the wind blowing through the trees. It's the place that we call home. We must protect it so the plants can grow. So, Blippi, what can we do to help the Earth? I'm glad you asked, actually. Hit it! Instead of throwing this away, we can make it into a house where a bird can stay. Tweet, tweet, little birdie. Here's a new home for you. <laughs> Wait! Before you throw that in the trash, Give it to me, and in a flash, I'll, I'll fix, fix it up for you. It's brand new. Helping Earth is what we have to do. And it's the home for you and me. Planet Earth is the place to be. Come on, everyone, join the Planet Earth Party. It's the Planet Earth Party. <laughs> so, Blippi, what other things can we do to protect the Earth? We can sort the trash into different bins. Bottles, cans, and cardboard. Yeah, throw them in. Sort them out. Recycling is what it's all about. Woohoo! Don't forget the buzzy, buzzy bees. We need them to pollinate the flowers, don't you see? So the plants can grow. Come on, little bees, this way. <laughs> when it's the home for you and me. Planet Earth is the place to be. Earth Party. What are you doing, Mika? I'm planting a tree. See, the world is full of plants, flowers, and trees. Yeah. The plants help the earth breathe. <laughs> when it's the home for you and me, planet Earth is the place to be. Come on, everyone, join the planet Earth Party. Home, is it, Blippi? Exactly! We share our home with so many different animals. And we need to keep the Earth healthy and happy so all the animals can be happy and healthy too. From the elephants on the savannah to the polar bears at the North Pole, the monkeys in the jungle. Yeah, we all call the Earth our home when it's the home for you. Thanks yeah. for dancing along with oh, me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but after all that singing and dancing, I'm definitely in need of a snack. Oh, look, there's a picnic table over there. Whoa, let's go eat a snack there. OK. <sighs> oh, this is so nice. <laughs> well, what snack should we eat, Mika? I have some fruit in my jam pack. Whoa, I love eating fruit. Yeah, I especially love fruit because it's an always food. Yeah, you can always have a healthy snack by eating some fruit. Mm-hmm. Look at this bright red apple. Oh, and I have a bright orange banana. Wait a minute. Orange? <laughs> it's a yellow banana. Yeah, <laughs> one of silly. my favorite colors. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, this definitely is going to be a tasty snack for me. <laughs> yeah. Oh, got to just peel it. Mm -hmm. 
and then take a bite. Oh, how's your apple? Delicious. How's your Nana? <laughs> yeah! That is so yummy and sweet. <laughs> I certainly love eating yummy fruits and vegetables. Me too, especially with my best friend. Do you like to eat fruits and vegetables too? <laughs> awesome! <laughs> well, Mika, mm -hmm. when we're done eating, we're gonna have some leftover food scraps. We should mm -hmm. probably find a place to put them. I don't see any place nearby. Yeah, we don't want to litter and just throw them out in nature. Mm -hmm. We need to find a place to put our banana peel and our apple core. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe we can keep going down the trail and we'll find somewhere. Okay. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Whoa. 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 Okay, Let's keep going down the trail, <laughs> eating our yummy snacks, and keep on the lookout for a place to put our scraps. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, Mika, look at this. Whoa. I wonder what it is. A trash can? Mm, maybe, but it doesn't quite look like one. <gasps> hey, do you know what shape this is? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a triangle. It's two triangles. <laughs> oh yeah, it is. One, two. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm Blippi. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. <laughs> hi, I'm Hillary. I'm an eco-educator here at Tree People. Ooh, oh, Hillary. Nice Hillary. What is this triangular thing? Yeah. That's a great question. This is actually two different types of soil. Whoa, yeah, check it out. Look, looks like there's some sandy soil in this one mm -hmm. and some mushy green brown looking soil in this one. <laughs> <laughs> so one of these sides is actually sick soil. Can you guess which side is our sick soil? Uh, mm. this side? Um, you're close. It's actually this side. Oh, yeah. Well, you think we need to take that dirt to the doctor? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> this side is our sick city soil because it doesn't have a lot of nutrients in it. Oh, oh. yeah. Look, there are some concrete blocks on the top. That probably is not too good for the soil. No, that actually represents our sidewalks in the city. Oh, Ooh. and what about this one over here? So this is our healthy soil. That's the type of soil you're gonna see out here at tree people or around on hikes. Yeah, Ooh. look, there's some leaves, mm -hmm. <laughs> hang on some bark, mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's definitely green looking. Yeah, it oh. looks nice and healthy. <laughs> <laughs> well, Hillary, we also have some food scraps from our snack and we were wondering what we should do with them or where we could put them. That's a great question. You can actually put that in something called a compost bin. Oh, what's a compost bin? That's a great question. When you add your fruit and veggie scraps to a compost bin, it breaks down and it adds nutrients to the soil. Ooh. Wait, so putting our banana peels and apple cores in a compost bin, it would make the soil really healthy like that. Yes, exactly. Whoa. We eat it and get healthy, and then we make the soil healthy. <laughs> that sounds fun. <laughs> Actually, you guys should follow yeah? me up the hill. I know somebody special who can help you compost your food scraps. Oh, that sounds fun. That sounds so fun. Okay, we'll follow you. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think I'm going to go check and see if the dirt doctor is in. Okay, okay. see you soon, Hillary. <laughs> Whoa, hi, Dirt Doctor. Hey. <laughs> Wait a minute. You look awfully familiar. Well, anywho, it's nice to meet you. Well, why don't you guys follow me? Okay. Whoa. What's all this? These are all the ingredients that we need to make our compost. Oh, whoa, yeah, it looks like you have an awful lot of cool things here. Oh, and can we add our food scraps to the compost? Yes, you absolutely can. We need half parts greens and half parts brown. Do we have enough? You know, I think we actually need a little bit more of both. Mm. Okay. Well, I think we can go find some. Okay, sounds <laughs> great. Okay, we'll put our food scraps here and be right back. <laughs> See you soon. <laughs> well, Mika, what do you want to try to find? Some twigs. Ooh, and maybe I'll find some green leaves. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> perfect. Oh, and look, there's some green leaves here. <gasps> oh, but we should pick from the ground. Yeah, we don't want to hurt any of the trees or plants nearby. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, and look at all this. <laughs> yeah, all these green and brown things would be great to add for the compost. Mm -hmm. mm. Well, it looks like we got a lot of leaves and twigs and organic things. Ooh, some, <laughs> some berries too. Oh yeah, let's take this back to the dirt doctor. Ooh, ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
We brought it back to Earth Doctor. Okay, sounds great. Why don't we start off with our greens? Okay. All right, well, how about on the count of three, we do our food scraps and our green leaves, and uh, let's do a rainbow toss into the bucket. Great. Okay. <laughs> All right, ready? One, two, three. Rainbow! <laughs> <laughs> Well, what do we do after we add all the green things? To the now compost? we got to add our browns. So oh. why don't we do a little bit of all of the browns that we have? Okay, well, we have an awful lot of leaves. Yeah, can <laughs> you, you pass me some? Yeah, there Thank you go. Thank you. And I'll grab <laughs> some bark and some twigs. <laughs> all right, great. Now, on the count of three, I want you guys to do a slam dunk into Ooh. our bucket. Compost basketball. Let's all right, <laughs> ready? One, two, three. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we did it! Well, what do we add now? Now I'm just gonna add a little bit of water so that we can have some moisture in our compost bin. And why don't we mix this up? Can I stir? Of course! <laughs> yeah! Stir, stir, stir! Well, that's stir a good mixer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! And it looks like that water is helping to break it down, right? Exactly. And in two to three months, this is going to break down into a soil that's our compost. Whoa. And then what do we do? use the soil for? That's a great question. You can put it in your gardens and you can give it to your trees and your plants. Yeah, so they can grow big and strong. Speaking of plants, maybe we could uh, plant something? Yeah. Well, I'd love to plant something. Actually, I have something for both of you. Oh. I have white sage, which is a native plant. <gasps> wow, check it out. This white sage is so beautiful and the leaves are kind of fuzzy. <laughs> well, I would certainly love to plant these white sage with my best friend, Nika. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you so much, Dirt Doctor. It was really nice learning about so many things from you. <laughs> oh, and we'll see you soon, okay? Okay, sounds good. Thanks. Bye, Sal. I mean, dirt doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! I can't wait to plant our plants. There you go, oh, Mika. I have an idea. Oh, let's name our plants. Whoa, that's a great idea. Well, Mika, what are you going to name your white sage? Mmm, buttercup. Buttercup? <laughs> oh, I like that name. Thanks. I'm going to name mine. Charlie! Oh, Charlie and Buttercup. Aww. I hope they're very happy here. Yeah. Well, Mika, these are actually native to California, oh. which means they're from California. <laughs> uh-huh. That means they can grow in California even if it's dry and hot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're going to grow nice and big and strong. <laughs> Aw, this is so great. Well, I think oh. mine's looking pretty good. Yeah. Yours looks good, too. Let's put this flag here so we know that Buttercup and Charlie live here. Yeah, we don't want anyone to step on them, and we want to remember where we put them. Yeah. <laughs> well, this was so much fun celebrating yes, Earth Day. That was <laughs> awesome meeting the dirt doctor who taught us all about composting. Yeah, and what healthy and not so healthy soil looks like. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of our videos, all you have to do is search for our names. <laughs> hey, can you spell our names with us? Okay, here we go. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Will you spell my name with us? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> that was awesome. Well, we'll see you soon. <gasps> Happy Earth Day. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Play Lab in Eagle Rock, California. There's so many different kinds of toys to play with inside. There's even dinosaur toys. <laughs> and my friend Naisha is stopping by to teach us colors and American Sign Language. Let's go. Cool, a train table. Have you ever played with toy trains before? They're so fun. <gasps> Look at this one. There's one, two, Three, four cars. And they're sticking together. Check it out. They're magnetic, meaning they attract to each other. See, they stick together. Whoa, look at the wheels. Let's see the colors on top of here. We have orange, black, red, and red. All right, Conductor Mika, 
is ready to take this train on a trip. All aboard! All right, guess it's time for me to keep playing. See you later, train. <laughs> Let's go over here. This is a cool room to play in. Hey. Hello? <gasps> Hi, Grandma. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm just playing with my friends. Yeah, yeah. Can I call you back? Okay, bye, Grandma. <laughs> oh, and look, there's little babies in here. Oh, it's so cute. Hi, baby. Oh, what? Oh, it's nap time. Shh, sorry. Hey, I wonder if I could climb up here. It's kind of small. Do you think I'll fit? All right, I'll try it. Hello, up here. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it looks like I'm on a bridge. Oh, and there's a little slide. Three. Two, one, whoa! <laughs> what? You see dinosaurs? Oh, I love dinosaurs! Whoa, these are really cool. Look at this one. See the plates on the back? Oh, that means hello. <laughs> whoa, and this one has a crest. You know, a lot of dinosaurs that have a crest like this, instead of roaring, they would kind of sound like honk, honk, <laughs> honk, honk. Whoa, this one has some sharp teeth in there. Ooh, very cool. And this one has wings so we can fly. Whoa, these dinosaur toys are so cool. My favorite dinosaur is the T-Rex. I wonder if they have a T-Rex here. It's not that one. Not this one with the long neck. T-Rexes don't have long necks. Oh, here it is, the T-Rex. Hi, Mika. Hey, T-Rex, how are you? I'm fine, I wanna go down the slide. Oh, <laughs> you have to ask nicely. Can I go down the slide, please? Oh, sure. Here we go. All right, are you ready? Three, two, one. What's wrong? Oh, he's a little bit nervous. Let's just say, you can do it. You got this. Okay. You can do this. You got this. Come on, T-Rex. Yeah, you did it. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> Aw, that was fun. Whoa, look at these blocks. They're soft and squishy. Hmm, maybe we could build a tower. See if I could build a tower as tall as me. Whoa. Okay. I have to get even taller than that. Oh, have to have really good balance blocks. Oh, no. Come on. Taller, taller. It has to be taller. We gotta make the blocks even taller and taller. Come on, blocks, taller and no! <laughs> That's okay. Let me clean up real fast. <laughs> Hi, Naisha. Oh, who's your friend? This is my friend who's an interpreter. Her name is Rory. Oh, hi, Rory. I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So Rory's an interpreter, so she's going to help us communicate, which is good because I only know a little bit of sign language. And I'm so excited that you are both here so that we can learn some colors in American Sign Language. All right. Yes, we can. So let's start with, ooh, what about this balloon? Do you know what color this is? It's orange. So how do we say orange in American Sign Language? Like this? Okay, 
Are you doing it? Orange. Good job. Cool. All right, that orange. <laughs> Ooh, what about this one? It's one of my favorite colors. Do you know what it is? Purple, that's right. So how would we say purple? Oh, the letter P, right? Purple. Yeah, because P is the first letter in the word purple. I got it, cool. Bye, purple. Oh, do you know what color this balloon is? It's pink, good job. Okay, so how would we say pink? So the letter P again, and then you hit your chin like this. Pink. Good job. All right, bye pink. <laughs> Ooh, what about this little balloon? Do you know what color this is? It's blue. Ooh, like my fingernails. <laughs> How do we say blue in American Sign Language? Okay, so the letter B and then kind of wave it like that. Cool, are you trying it? Good job, blue. Bye, blue. And this balloon is what color? Red, nice. So how would we say red? Okay, so you take one finger and rub your chin like this, red. <laughs> nice, bye red. Oh yes, another one of my favorite colors. Do you know what it is? Yellow. Okay, how do we say yellow in American Sign Language? Okay, so like the letter Y, and then wave it. Can you do that? Yellow. Good job. Bye, yellow. Wow, thank you so much for teaching us how to say those colors in American Sign Language. It's great to see you and to be able to teach you. Oh, it's good to see you too, and really nice meeting you, Rory. All right, I'm gonna keep playing inside, but I hope to see you two later. <laughs> Bye. Oh, cool. There are more toys in here. A helicopter. <laughs> oh, look, a little car. Uh-oh, he needs a driver. Oh, I can drive. Oh. You can, can I see your driver's license? Whoop, looks like you, yep. Okay, get on in. All right, enjoy the ride. Vroom. Whoa, whoa, hey, slow down. My bad, it's okay. Nice park job. <laughs> oh, look at these circles. See a red circle. <gasps> Nice smile. <laughs> and let's see what's under the orange one. Oh, another friend. Hello. And another orange. <gasps> Hi. Oh, cool blue glasses. And let's look under this yellow one. Oh, hi. <laughs> and let's look under this other yellow one. Oh, hello. <laughs> I didn't know there were gonna be friends in there. Oh, cool, check out these shapes. It looks like this one's missing, but we could start with this circle. All right, let's go right there. And, oh, a triangle. All right, see you later, triangle. Do you know what this is? It has one, two, three, four, five sides. That's a pentagon. All right, later, Pentagon. And this is a trapezoid. Yeah, very cool shape. Go in there. Yeah, they all fit. Nice. Whoa, look at these colorful blocks. Let's check them out together. Hmm, let's see. I like this blue one and purple. Hmm, yellow. Or is this orange? This one's more like yellow, right? Yeah, orange, yellow, pink, and red. 
Wait a second. These are the colors that we learned with Naisha, remember? American Sign Language? Let's see if we can remember, okay? Do you remember how to say red? Red. Yeah, good job. What about pink? Do you remember how to sign pink? Pink. Pink. Good job. Ooh, what about yellow? I really like this one. Yellow. Remember? <laughs> and orange. Orange is, yeah, orange. And purple, one of my favorites. Remember? Purple. Good job. And what about blue? Yeah, make the letter B. Blue. Good job. That was so fun learning that today. <laughs> hey, I had so much fun playing with you today at Play Lab. There's so many different toys inside. We got to play with trains and dinosaurs. <laughs> and blocks. And my friend Naisha taught us some colors and American Sign Language. Wasn't that so cool? Thanks for learning with me. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Great! <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Okay, friends. Bye! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy! And it's me, Mika! Whoa! <laughs> and today we're at Candyland Indoor Playground! In Sherman Oaks, California! Yay. Whoa! And guess what? Today is... Opposite, Opposite Day! day. Whoa. Whoa! Do you know what an opposite is? Yeah! An opposite is one thing that is way different from another thing. <laughs> Just like... Up and down, or big and small, <laughs> or happy and sad, or hungry and full, <laughs> <laughs> and Blippi and Mika. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, and since today is opposite day, that's when you do everything in an opposite way. So instead of walking forward, you walk backwards. <laughs> Whoa! Look at this guy! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> That's silly. <laughs> and look! I'm wearing your favorite colors today. Blue and orange. <laughs> oh yeah, and Mika, I'm wearing your favorite colors. Ooh. Purple and yellow! Ooh! <laughs> oh, and Mika, I have an idea. Yeah? You normally want to start your day with breakfast, but Today is opposite day, so let's start it with dinner, because yeah. breakfast and dinner are opposites. <laughs> hey, I saw a supermarket back there. Let's dance backwards. Okay, let's go find some tasty food. <laughs> Woo! Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. We made it to the grocery store. <laughs> ooh, let's go grocery shopping. Mm -hmm. We need to find all the ingredients to make dinner. <laughs> Whoa, and look, there's a little shopping cart here. <laughs> oh, but since it's opposite day, we'll drive it like this. <laughs> Whoa. Would you like some rice? Whoa, upside down rice. <laughs> I would love some. Ooh, and we should probably get some upside down crackers. <laughs> mm -hmm. That'd be $4. Oh, thank you. There you go. <laughs> oh, uh oh, it's supposed to go that way. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> well, opposite day is pretty silly. <laughs> Here you are, peaches, free of charge. Aw, free peaches, yum. <laughs> but we also want to put some vegetables in our dinner too. Right. So we have <laughs> vegetables. Yum. And <gasps> some corn. Ooh. <laughs> oh, and mm, some other stuff too. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, thanks Mika. <laughs> Here they come. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> well, Mika, we have a lot of food here, but we need to cook it now. Oh, let's go to the kitchen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. <Ooh. laughs> let's put your apron on. Oh, yeah, Chef Blippi needs an apron. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my apron, Mika? It's opposite day, so it's on your back. Oh, <laughs> that's so silly. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Well, we want to see if there's any other fruits and vegetables maybe in the kitchen we can use. Ooh, yeah. let's check it out in here. Ooh. 
Oh, check it out. Ooh. Fruit and vegetables. Whoa, and look at these. <laughs> Mika, they're your two favorite colors. Well, they're your two favorite colors today. Oh, yeah. <laughs> today, my two favorite colors are yellow, whoops, <laughs> and purple. Ooh. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> we'll put those into our dinner. And look, there are other fruits and vegetables that are different colors, Ooh. like red, green. <laughs> Definitely want some of those. <laughs> and Orange! Oh, one of my favorite colors. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Orange and blue are your two favorite <laughs> colors today, Mika. <laughs> okay, well, now we just need to put some on some plates mm -hmm. and we need to put some in the oven. <laughs> Here we go. May I have some pepper, please? Oh, yes, you may. There you go. <laughs> Tasty! Whoa, so yummy! <laughs> Whoa, dinner's looking like it's almost done. Flippy, I have a great idea. Oh, what's that? What do you usually eat after dinner? Hmm, do you know what you usually eat after you eat dinner? <laughs> yeah, that's right, dessert. <laughs> I love dessert. <laughs> well, since it's opposite day, let's have dessert before our dinner. Whoa, that's a great idea. <laughs> well, but we should probably also bring our food so we can still eat dinner. Yes. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here we go. Ready? <laughs> let's go. Whoa, here we go. <laughs> well, Mika, we made it. Yay. <laughs> and before we eat dessert, before dinner, because it's opposite day, mm -hmm. we should probably pick out what we want to eat for dinner. Yeah. Hmm, Mika, what are you gonna have? Uh, I would like some mushrooms, please. Ooh, there are some mushrooms. And a carrot as well. Ooh, and a carrot for you. Thank you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have some tuna fish <laughs> with a lemon. Ooh. <laughs> well, we'll set this here for later, because remember, it's opposite day. We're having dinner for breakfast, but... We'll have ice cream first. <laughs> okay, now let's make some ice cream. <laughs> Whoa, check out all these flavors. Oh, there's so many. <laughs> oh, they're so colorful too. Ooh, what flavor do you think this is? Hmm, it's brown, so it's Probably chocolate. <gasps> Tasty. Yum. And look, this color is the color pink. Mm -hmm. What flavor do you think this ice cream is? Hmm, how about strawberry? <laughs> I love strawberry. <laughs> hmm. Oh, green ice cream. Whoa, Mika, is that broccoli flavored? Yeah, <laughs> extra nutritious. <laughs> yeah. Well, it may be probably kind of sort of might be mint chocolate chip. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Mika, can I make you an ice cream cone? Yes, please. How many scoops would you like? Four. Four scoops of ice cream? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, here we go. One. Two. Three. And four Whoa. scoops. <laughs> And I'll give you a little bit of caramel on top. Ooh, tasty. <laughs> Thank you, friend. Mm, and Mika, could you help me make an ice cream cone? Of course. Mm. How many scoops? I think I'll just have one scoop of ice cream. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I want to have room for dinner Whoa. later. <laughs> Whoa. One scoop. And how about some sprinkles? Okay. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> Do you hear that? Yeah. Kind of sounds like shakers. Oh, and I love music. <laughs> I love ice cream. I love ice cream too. It's I so tasty. tasty. <laughs> Whoa, that was a good ice cream song. <laughs> well, ice cream songs are so fun to sing before you have some ice cream. Oh, so Mika, here you go. But be careful. Remember, it's opposite day. So cold ice cream on opposite day is actually Lava hot! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> oh, it's really hot in here. Ready? <laughs> here we go. Cheers, cheers. Hurry before it melts. <laughs> <laughs> that was silly. Yes. <laughs> and now that we had our dessert before dinner, <laughs> time to eat dinner. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here's your dinner. Thank you. Oh, yummy, yummy dinner. Here we go. <laughs> well, that was pretty funny. Are you ready to play? 
Yeah. Me Ooh. too. Hmm. I wonder what we'll do today. <gasps> Let's go explore. Okay. Come on. <laughs> This fire station is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Check out this truck. Whoa, this fire truck looks so fast and loud. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. Ooh, safety gear. Whoa, yeah. After a fire, you probably need to repair some of the homes or buildings that caught on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Mika, is that a megaphone? Yes, it is. Mika! Firefighter Mika! It's time to save the day! Coming! <laughs> coming to save the day! <laughs> okay, Firefighter Blippi, we'll help you out! <laughs> Thank you very much! Oh, but wait a second, Mika. It's office day, remember? Yes. Maybe, instead of being really loud, you need to be really quiet! Oh, yeah! Firefighter Mika! Oh, yeah! We need to go save everyone from the fire! Rear, rear, rear! Here rear, 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 rear. <laughs> <laughs> On opposite day, sirens! that are normally very loud are actually very quiet. <laughs> That's silly. <laughs> Whoa, and look at that! An actual firefighter helmet! Ooh. Whoa, <laughs> and good thinking, Mika. Backwards! Since it's opposite day. <laughs> oh, and since we're in the fire station, I don't need to have an apron anymore. <laughs> Put this over here. <gasps> Check it out. Whoa, what's that? It is a vest. Whoa, a fire vest. <laughs> oh, but there's only one. Hmm. You can have it. Aw, that's nice, but then you won't have one. Hmm, I'll let you have it. Okay. <laughs> Actually, I have one in my jam pack for you. <laughs> Whoa, that was really thoughtful. And good planning, Mika. <laughs> yes, I love to plan. <laughs> okay, firefighter helmet on. Mm-hmm. And my fire jacket mm -hmm. on too. <laughs> and now we just need to go find a fire. Okay, let me grab my extinguisher. Okay, and I'll grab the megaphone so I can be really quiet. <laughs> Here we go. Here we come Woo! to save the day. Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> Hooray! But firefighter Mika, uh -huh. wait a minute, it's opposite day. Instead of going forward, uh -huh. I think we need to drive backwards. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go! Woo! Mirror! Get out of the way! Whoa, Mika! Look at this ball pit! Woo, so colorful! Oh, yeah, it's all different colors mm -hmm. like green and pink, and blue and green. <laughs> Whoa, hey, and look! purple and yellow. Hey, <laughs> just like those slides. Oh yeah, those slides are also purple and yellow. Mm -hmm. My two favorite colors, <laughs> today at least. <laughs> Since it's opposite day, let's go up the slides. Okay, you normally would go down, but it's opposite day. Let's do it. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, okay. Wait, let's check to see if anyone's coming down. Mm -hmm. Hmm, no one's coming down. And remember, always go down a slide. We have special permission from grown-ups to go up the slide today. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll see you at the top. <laughs> this is pretty slippery. <laughs> I made it! Whoa! And I Come on, Blippi, you're so too. close! Whoa! Woohoo! <laughs> I made it too! Hey, this calls for a 10 second dance break! Yeah. We did it! We did it! We never ever quit it! We did, we did it! it. Yeah. <laughs> that was really fun. Hmm, but I think I know just what to do next. What? Well, we went up the slides. Let's go down the stairs! Yeah! <laughs> okay, we'll see you at the bottom! Woohoo! Ready, friend? Ready. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa, that was pretty fun. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> it sure is fun playing on opposite day. Yeah, and since it's opposite day, let's jump out 
out of the ball pit instead of into the ball pit. <laughs> okay, but who should go first? Me. Okay. <laughs> okay. First, you want to get covered with all the ball pit balls. Yes, please. Cover me up. Okay. There we go. Ready, and... set, run! <laughs> oh! <laughs> okay. okay, you're next. Now it's my turn. Okay, I'm gonna try to get totally covered ball pit balls. Here we go. See you soon. Woo. All right, all set. Three, two, one. Whoa! 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 That was so much fun. Yeah. And I had a really great time celebrating Opposite Day with you. Oh, you came up with some great opposites. Mm, you did too. Oh, thanks, Ren. Yeah, well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of our videos, all you have to do is search for our names. Hey, since it's Opposite Day, can I spell your name and you can spell mine? Mm -hmm. Yeah, here we go. B L I P V I. Bolippy. <laughs> and can you spell my name with me? Oh, Mika's name? <laughs> M E E K A H. Mika. Mika. <laughs> Good job. Well, we'll see you soon. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Oh. Hello. <laughs> to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Mika. And today I'm at the Lang Foundation in Los Angeles, California. And here you can adopt a dog or a cat and then they can be part of your family. Oh, there's a dog right there. Oh, hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Megan. Hi, Megan, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. This is Willow. Oh, hi, Willow. Oh, it's always important to ask before you pet an animal. Uh, can I pet Willow? Yes, you can. Okay. So just Crouch down so you're on her level uh -huh. and put your fist out so she can hey. smell you. Willow, Willow. Oh, what do you think? Aww. <laughs> so sweet. Well, are there more animals inside? There are. Oh, let's go check them out. So what is this little one's name? This is Sprout. <gasps> Sprout, what a cute name. Hi, Sprout. I have some treats for Sprout. Is Sprout allowed to have a treat? Yes, he okay. is. Let's see, you want a treat? You think Sprout Aww. likes treats? <laughs> Aw. Can we bring Sprout down to the ground and yeah. see if Sprout will want to play with us? Aw. Whoa, cool squeaky toy. It's a pink snake. <laughs> so once someone adopts an animal, what do they need to take care of the animal? Yeah, so for dogs, they need a leash, a collar, a harness, um, food, bowls, uh, and a lot of toys. Whoa! Food, bowls, toys. It's a lot of work to take care of an animal. It they is. need a lot of things. Aww, and is it different for cats? Yeah, so cats would need um, also food, bowls, uh, litter box, litter. Um, some good things to scratch on. Oh yeah, cats love to scratch. And a safe <laughs> carrier in case you need to take them to the vet. Oh wow. So you get a lot of things once you adopt an animal here. Yes, yes, we give people some of the food that they've been eating, um, some toys. And where do you get all of these toys? They have so many fun things to play with here. We get a lot of it donated. If oh, people yeah? have extra supplies, they donate them to us. And yeah, it's a big help for us. Whoa, what a great idea to donate toys for these dogs and cats to play with. <laughs> oh, what's this toy? Where did these animals come from? So we rescue these animals from city shelters. Uh, basically, the shelters are crowded with animals, so we take them and find them new homes. Oh, that's really nice. And if someone wants to adopt an animal, what do they do? So we would have them come in and meet some of the animals. They'd fill out an application, and we would help them find the right animal that matches their family. Wow, that's awesome! It's so fun to play with cats and dogs, but it's also important to remember you have to take very special care of them. Whoa, come look at this dog. Whoa, what kind of dog is this? This is an American Bully Mix. American Bully Mix, whoa. 
This is a bigger dog. Aw. And she's so loving. What's her name? Uh, her name is Lady. Hi, Lady. Aw. So, so sweet. What's this? A blue. Oh, like a little mouse with a super long tail. <laughs> Aw. This dog is so cool. Ooh, and I love the purple leash. One of my favorite colors. Love your leash. Oh, and what's on her belly here? Yeah, so she's definitely had a litter of puppies. Wow, a litter of puppies? That's so cool. How many puppies do you know? Um, I don't, but I think they can have up to 10 puppies. Whoa, that's a lot of puppies. Wow. Oh, well, it was nice to meet you. Thanks for playing with us. Louise is ready for her bandage change. Okay, great. Aww. Hi. So what room is this? So this is our medical treatment area. Oh, a medical treatment area. So this is where animals go to be taken care of if they're sick or they have Maybe they hurt themselves. What's wrong with her leg? So we rescued her with a broken leg. Aww. And yeah, now she has a cast on and she's healing. Oh, good. That must mean she's feeling better. She definitely is. Yeah, I can hear some purring there. She's purring really loud. Yeah, cats purr when they're in a great mood, right? Aww. And why is she wearing a big yellow flower? She looks super cute, and yellow is one of my favorite colors. <laughs> so that's an e-collar, and it keeps her from taking her bandage off. Oh, that's so smart and super cute. <laughs> are there other cats that we can see? There are. Oh, let's go see some more cats. Feel better. Cool. Welcome to the catio. Get it? Cat catio. It's the catio. <laughs> now they said that there are a lot of cats in here. Hmm. Will you help me find them? <laughs> awesome. Okay. Whoa. Look at all this. It kind of looks like something you would see at a playground. The cats can climb up here and they can scratch. <laughs> Come over here. A cat, can you see it? Oh, it's sleeping. We found our first cat. Good job. Hmm. Oh, there's another cat over here. You see it? Hi, cat. That cat looks really soft. <laughs> and there's another cat. Hi, kitty. Wow, so we found one. Two, three cats so far. Wow. Hmm. Do you see any other cats? <gasps> Come down here, all the way to the floor. There are two cats in there. They're cuddling. <gasps> I wonder if they're best friends. <laughs> Hi. They're so cute. So we have one, two, three, four, five cats so far. I wonder if there's any more. <laughs> oh, wow. There's some water and some food in here. They take really good care of their cats. Hmm. Oh, look down here at these little boxes. I see some blankets in here so the cats can be nice and comfy cozy. Oh, and look, it's a cutout of a cat face. That's cool. I don't see any cats though, do you? Hmm. Oh, I see one right here. Oh my goodness. Shh, this cat is taking a cat nap. Whoa, it looks really comfortable. I wonder if cats have dreams. Hmm. So, one, two, three, four, five, six cats. We found six cats. Thanks for finding cats with me. I wonder what else is here. Come on. Check it out. I'm in a cat room. 
this is where all the cats are hanging out, relaxing like this one. Whoa, hi, I'm Mika. This room is so cool. There's a tree in here. Whoa, I bet the cats like to scratch on the tree. Maybe they scratch their back on there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whoa, and cool thing is to climb on. Look, a little cat toy, a little mouse. What else is over here? Whoa! Do you know what this is? This long yellow tube? The cats can climb up here and then climb through the tube. Maybe you've done something like that at a playground before? They must have so much fun here. And in each little cubby is where the cat can go and have a little nap. Any cats in here? Oh, there's a cat in there. I didn't even know that. Hi. <gasps> There's two cats in there. I don't know if you can see. There's two cats just hanging out. Oh, a teddy bear. I wonder if cats like to cuddle with stuffed animals. That's <laughs> so sweet. Aw. Well, I have a cat toy. Have you ever seen anything like this before? Let's see if some of these cats want to play with it, okay? Um. <laughs> Anyone want to play with me today? What about you? <laughs> this cat's like, please don't bother me. I'm trying to take a nap right now. Okay, understood, understood. Okay, hey look, there's big bowls of water here because it's important for cats to hydrate. Just like us. Hey, something else that they can climb on. And look, these little holes, these little hidey holes that they can just get all comfy. Cats seem to nap a lot. <laughs> hey, Megan. Hey. Oh my goodness. Who I is this? One more friend for you to see. This oh is Memphis. Oh my gosh. Can I hold Memphis? Yes. Oh, look at this little kitten. <gasps> How old is Memphis? He's eight weeks. Eight weeks? Just a little baby kitten. Wow, Memphis is brand new to the world. Oh, Wait, is Memphis from Memphis? Um, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't know how we got the name Memphis. Oh, it's a super cute name. So Memphis is only eight weeks old. What does Memphis usually do? Um, he plays with his two brothers. <gasps> you have two yeah, brothers? Yeah, two brothers. Oh, that's so fun. Wow, baby kittens are so teeny tiny. Aww, it's so nice meeting you, Memphis. Oh my goodness. You do such a good job taking care of all of these animals. Aww, thank you. Aww. <laughs> well, thanks for letting me hang out with you, Memphis. <laughs> that was so fun, getting to hang out with dogs and cats today. We learned about how to take care of our pets and adopt them and make them part of our family. Oh, cats and dogs are so cool. Well, this is wearing a space suit because I'm going on a very special space mission. My plan is to experience a spacewalk, experience landing and driving on Mars and going to Mars base. But it's all simulation style, which means I'm not really going to space, but it's sure gonna feel like it. Will you come with me? Oh, let's go. Hey. Hi. Who are you? I'm Daniel. Oh, hi, Daniel. I'm Mika. Hi. <laughs> so what do you do here? I'm an educator here at Kennedy Space Center. So oh. I teach kids all about science, technology, history, a lot of really cool topics. Wow, you must know a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what is this? Uh, this is actually a 3D model of the International Space Station, the ISS. ISS. OK, so that stands for International mm -hmm. Space Station. 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 You got ISS. it. ISS. Cool. Oh, yeah. Now, it's really, really big. It's about as big as a football field. Whoa, that is really, really big. Yeah. And what's this long part in the middle here? So the long part in the middle is called the truss segment. Oh, the truss. OK. Yeah. And what does that do? So that holds the things like the solar panels, a lot of cool instruments and experiments. The astronauts usually just live in the middle. Uh -huh. They don't usually go out there all that often. Why would they need to go out there? Well, sometimes you got to uh, repair stuff or replace things. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Now, something we also have 
that's really, really cool here is a simulator that'll kind of show you how astronauts actually train to go out there. Really? Yeah. Could I try? Totally. Oh, let's do it. Whoa, Daniel, what's all this? So these are all our tools and equipment and replacement parts that we're gonna use in our simulator. Wow, that's gonna be awesome. Oh yeah. What's all in here? So there's tons of different things. We have different wrenches and different mm -hmm. equipment. One that's very important that you're gonna use today is this one right here. Oh, hey, it looks like the letter T. Yeah, that's actually where it gets its name. It's called the T-handle wrench. Oh, makes sense, T-handle wrench, oh, okay. Yeah. We actually have a bigger version of that. It's this one right here. Whoa, and look at this. It looks like the letter L. And that's what its name is, L-handle wrench. Oh, L-handle wrench. Works out. Easy to remember. Oh yeah. Whoop. This way. There you go, you got it. Okay. Now we're just gonna use this little one today, but we have other things that we can use to replace stuff. We have something right here called a dust environment. This Ooh. one is to try to capture micrometeorites and particles in space and dust and debris. Wow. We have this little one right here. It's an electronics module. It's huh. for computers and stuff like that. Looks complicated. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm gonna give you an easy one to deal with. It's called a vibration detection system. Whoa, what does that do? Careful, it's very heavy, okay? okay? So that detects if the station shakes or shimmies or anything kind of crazy like that. And that would be very, bad? Yes, okay. it'd be very bad. Okay, so this okay. is super important. Yes. Okay. So what's gonna happen is that when I put you in the chair, okay, mm -hmm. we're gonna find that on the truss, uh -huh. and then you're gonna replace it. Wow, cool, okay, yeah. I can't wait. And I'm gonna give you this little one uh -huh. to replace it. We can test it right now so you get a little better understanding before we go. Okay, okay? let's test it out. So you're gonna grab onto that. Uh -huh. Okay. Now when you put it inside, it's kind of like a screwdriver. Okay. You put it in and push it straight down. There you go. Okay. And then you're gonna turn it halfway. Halfway, like that? Yep, there you go. Okay. Now when you do that, it's gonna come out and it's gonna fall down. Okay, So good make to sure know. not to let it fall on you, okay? okay? Then I'm gonna give you the new one. You're gonna give me the old one. Okay. Okay. And then when you put the new one in, you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna push and half turn. The other way? Yep. Ah. And then that new one will be in place and you've replaced something. Oh, awesome. Okay, well, let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, buckling in. Oh, the seatbelt is very much like the one you would use on an airplane. Yeah, exactly. Okay, nice okay. and tight. Now, you're in our microgravity chair. This is what we're gonna use to kind of simulate our spacewalk. Yeah, that's right, okay. microgravity. And for a spacewalk, you use your hands, not your feet. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, I want you to have your head all the way back against like that little okay. pillow. Okay, I'm gonna rock you back. It's gonna feel like being in a dentist chair. Ooh, okay. okay. So, rocking you back. Okay. All right. Feel okay? Yeah, nice and cozy. You ready? Yeah. Okay, starting in three, two, one. Now it's really loud, Ooh, okay? Yeah, it's a little loud. Yeah. Now I'm gonna push you underneath. Whoa. Okay. Now you can reach your arms up. Okay. Okay. And I want you to catch the truss. There, so got you got it. it. Now you can try moving up and down. Okay. Just use your arms though, remember, no feet. Ooh. Yep, so you're at the bottom. Now try moving all the way up to the top. Notice how easy it is to move? Yeah, yeah, it's really fun. Yeah. Cool. And it feels like I'm floating. Wow. <laughs> wow. So, I want you to come right here to station 108. Okay? 108. Because we got oh. a job to do, not just having fun, okay? Yeah, here it is, 108, ready for my job. Yeah, so we're gonna replace this instrument right here, okay? Okay. So I'm gonna give you some tools, remember? This is awesome. I'm working on the truss like a real astronaut. <laughs> so do you see the old vibration unit in front of you? Yep. I'm gonna give you the T-handle wrench. Okay. And you're gonna take it out. Remember, don't let it fall on you. All right. Okay, so push yeah, up. Yeah, this needs to be replaced. Good thing I'm here. I am very good at replacing these old things. Ugh. There you go. Old one's out. Next. I'll take the old one. <laughs> Here's the new one. Okay. Okay. Whoop. Turn it around. You got it. Okay. That goes there. Yep. Okay. Put it there. Push it in. Push Whoop. it straight up. Turn your handle wrench a little tiny bit more to the right. Okay. A little bit more. 
Okay. There you go. Now it's And then talking. let go. And you're all good. All right there, buddy. That one's good to go. Perfect. <laughs> I'll take the wrench back. All right. Okay. But hey, we finished our job. Awesome. Good job. I'm going to get you out of the chair, okay? Okay. So. Whoa. Stay right there. You can let go. Okay. okay. You're floating away from the station. Oh, no. Bye. <laughs> Wow, I could take a nap in this chair. Well, you you can now that you've done your job, okay? <laughs> but bringing you back down to Earth. Three, right? two, one. Welcome oh, back. That was a quick ride. Oh, yeah. Hello, Earth. Okay. And there you wow. go. Thank you so much for letting me experience that. Yeah, no problem. That was really cool. So I got to feel what it would be like to do a spacewalk. Now I want to know what it feels like to travel to Mars. To Mars? Do you have that here? We do. Really? Yeah. Oh, can we do it? Totally. Oh, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> come on. So come on over this way. Oh, I can't wait to see this. Oh, yeah. Come on. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. Look over there. It says Lander Rover Simulator 1. That's so cool. Yeah. So over here, we have a really amazing simulator. Wow! Okay. Yeah. This is gonna show you how you're gonna fly to Mars, how you're gonna land on Mars, and then how you're gonna drive on Mars. <laughs> That's okay. amazing! And remember, yeah. it's a simulation, so it's not real, but it's gonna make me feel like I'm really traveling to Mars. Yeah. Now, we have two different positions, okay? Because whenever we do anything with NASA, we try to have a buddy system. Always okay. have a backup. So okay. two people. Yes, two people. So we have a commander mm -hmm. who's gonna fly the thing. That's uh, you. Yes, okay. okay. And then we have a pilot who's gonna drive it. In this oh. case, it's a robot, so you're okay. Wow, so you yeah. fly there, land, and then you can drive? Yeah. That's so cool. Right? Do you wanna go inside? Yes, I do. Okay, so Bye. head on down the stairs. Okay. okay. And then you're gonna sit in this seat right here. Okay? Oh. There you go. Whoa. It's cool, right? Yeah. Yeah. Now, we're gonna make sure you're as safe as possible. Okay. Okay. So if you look up above, you probably notice something very similar. Oh, yeah. It looks like a seat that you would sit in on a roller coaster. Yeah, exactly. Okay. We wanna make sure you're as safe as possible. Okay. That's okay. Good. So I'm gonna lock you in. Okay. Okay. What I want you to do, put your arms up and you're about to go on a roller coaster. Okay. Okay. And then the restraints are gonna come down. <laughs> Okay. Here we go. Nice and secure. All good? Feel yeah. safe? Okay. Now, what's gonna happen is when I close this door, we're gonna start the simulator and you're gonna fly and do all the cool stuff on Mars. Okay, okay. awesome. You ready? Yes, I'm so ready. Awesome, okay. So I'm gonna close the door now. All Bye. Right. See you soon. I'm going to Mars. <laughs> Whoa. It really feels like I'm getting ready to go to Mars. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, here I go. Welcome back. That was amazing. <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? You did wow. a great job. Thank you. Now I'm gonna get you out of there, okay? okay? So first things first, the restraints. We're gonna raise those up, okay? There you go. Whoa. Good job. Okay. You can come on out this way. Be very Whoa. careful though. <laughs> you can use the handrail, yeah. That was wild. Did you see me flip upside down? <laughs> Whoa. You okay? Yeah, I'm good, I'm okay. good. <laughs> so is that what it feels like to land on Mars and then drive on Mars? A little bit, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a good wow. simulation, right? Yeah, that was really fun. Thanks for letting me experiment oh, with no that. Oh, no problem, yeah. So 
before that, you got to drive to our Mars Base 1 in uh -huh. the simulation. Yep. Do you want to see our simulated Mars base that we actually have here? Oh, yeah, that's last on my list. Awesome. All right. Want to go? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> cool. Come on. Come on over this way. Whoa. <gasps> wow. So welcome to our Mars Base 1 Botany Lab. Oh, thank you. I've never been in a space like this before. Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah, it's very cool. Lots of plants in here. Yeah, we have tons of different varieties of plants because we want to see what types of things we could grow on Mars. Oh, why would you want to see what can grow on Mars? That's a really good question. So if we're going to go to Mars, like we plan to do, so we can work and do scientific experiments, mm -hmm. we got to test what we could have to eat on Mars. Because we can't oh. bring all the food we're going to take there. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Now, growing on Mars is really difficult. It's not like Earth. Oh. Yeah. Is there not dirt on Mars? Well, there's dirt on Mars. But when it comes to Mars, it doesn't have the right things that plants need to grow. Oh. So do you happen to know what things plants need to grow? Yeah. They need light and water and dirt or soil packed with nutrients, and you need the right temperature. Yeah, so they need tons and tons of stuff, and it's all very specific yeah. to the type of plant. Mm -hmm. Now, when it comes to Mars, it has dirt, but there's no nutrients in it. Oh. So if I just went outside and grabbed any old dirt, it's not really gonna simulate how well it works on Mars. Oh, well what does it feel like? What's the dirt feel like on Mars? Well, I have a really good example. So this is oh. some of the stuff that we use. Oh, cool. It's a simulation of what Martian dirt or soil is like. So this isn't really from Mars? No, it's not really from Mars. Huh. Look at this. Whoa. Kind of feels like a bunch of little rocks or little pebbles. Yeah. Huh. So it's like a lot of clay and iron. It's not good for plants, sadly. So we have to add in nutrients, plant food, so that way they can grow a lot easier. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah. Now, like I was saying, we've grown tons of stuff in here. Yeah, I can uh, tell. We've grown things like lettuces and even tomatoes. <gasps> I love tomatoes! Wow, can you imagine eating a tomato that grew on Mars? <laughs> it's wow. super cool, right? Yeah. Now, other things that we've grown I want to show you are some of our peas. So come on over this way. So these are some of the peas that we've actually grown. We've tested different types of plants, but we also want to test how those plants grow in different conditions. Okay. So some of the things you mentioned before of growing include water. We have water in the trays. That helps them grow. All right. And then we have some nutrients in some of the arcelite, the dirt in there. Mm -hmm. And then we have different types of light even. Oh, different types of light. Oh, yeah, it does look different. Yes, yeah, so you can put your hand underneath. So down here we have like this weird purple magenta. Ooh, I love purple. Yeah. <laughs> it's got red and blue little lights. And then up here on top, we have oh. some white light with it. It's a little bit different. Yeah, it looks very different. Yeah. So we want to test how the plants grow in different light conditions. Oh, like these plants up top are growing a lot higher than these plants here on the bottom. Yes. So hey, we know now for the peas to use more of these lights rather than these ones. Oh, just always experimenting. Yeah, and you can even see some of the ones that we've Whoa. kept growing even longer. They're super, super high because they have that nice light. See, they're growing towards the light? Yeah. Wow, they really like this light. Yeah, yeah. Wow, well, thank you so much for teaching me all about space and what it would feel like to land and drive on Mars and spacewalk and now Mars base? Yeah. <laughs> You've been awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Well, have a good day. I'll You're see you around. <laughs> Bye. Thanks, Daniel. Let's go. Wow, we did everything on my list. What a great day. We got to experience a spacewalk experience landing and driving on Mars, <laughs> and we got to go to Mars base. Wow, space is so amazing. Thanks for learning with me today. <laughs> well, that's the end of this mission and the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. <gasps> Will you spell my name with me on Mars? <laughs> okay, M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Oh, I gotta go, that's my ride. Bye. Come on everyone, let's make a learning fun. Mika, Mika, so much
much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! you can do on the speedway. Ooh, there's a lot of people on a racing team. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and a lot of other jobs that help get ready for the race. Yeah. Oh, let's go meet some people who work here. Okay, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I wonder what this job does. Whoa, check it out. There's a platform there at the top of a really, really tall so step tall. ladder. <laughs> hmm, wait a minute. The person that stands there waves all the flags during a race. <gasps> These flags? Yeah, those flags. <laughs> oh, and there certainly are a lot of them. They're oh. so colorful. Whoa, look, there's a green flag. Uh-huh, what does that mean? Mm, this means the race is starting. <laughs> and a yellow. That means caution, caution, slow down. Oh, there's a dinosaur on the track. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Red? Red means stop. <laughs> oh. And checkered! Oh, that means you win! Congratulations! Yeah. You've got first place, so when you pass the finish line, they wave the checkered <gasps> flag. Look! Wait a minute. If that is the, where the person that waves the flag stands, that means... Finish line! We're standing on the finish line! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Yeah? I have a good idea, Mika. What? What if you and I pretend to be a driver and one of the flag wavers? Okay, you drive. Okay. I'll wave. Okay, there are your flags. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start my engines. Slow down for the yellow flag. <laughs> Don't move a muscle. Not until I wave the green. Green. <laughs> yeah. Green. Okay. Winner, winner. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the checkered flag. <laughs> Race car driving is a lot of work. Hey, <laughs> check it out. Oh, I wonder what's up there. <gasps> wow. We're Whoa. so high. Check it out, there are so many cars down there. Oh. <laughs> hey, Blippi, wanna play I Spy? Oh, I'd love to. You can go first. Okay, hmm, I spy with my little Blippi eye <laughs> something green. Something green. Do you see something green? Oh, is it the field? <laughs> yeah, it's all the grass right there down by the track. <laughs> okay, now it's your turn. <laughs> okay, I spy with my Mika eye something white. <laughs> Whoa, this one's gonna be tricky. Uh huh. <laughs> well, is it a white car? No, not a white car. Try again. The white tents? Mm, not the white tents. One more try. What about the white lights? It's the white clouds. <laughs> oh, yeah, there are certainly a lot of clouds. So that was fun. <laughs> hey, I spy with my Mika eye somebody with a cool job. <laughs> Whoa, well, we've been learning about cool jobs. Let's go say hi. Hello, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. Oh, hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Brandon. Nice to meet you guys. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Brandon. <laughs> Brandon, what do you do? I am a spotter. Oh, a spotter. What does that mean? <laughs> but that means I spot for the number three car of Austin Dillon, and I tell him what's going on around the racetrack. Like, I tell him inside or outside or one back behind you oh. or where the crashes are. Oh, no way. That's like playing I Spy in real life. Yeah. Yeah, we like to play I Spy, too. Sounds <laughs> like a really important job. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, and so you tell them inside, outside, there's cars back. Is that to help them go faster? And if there's like a loose tire, they don't get into an accident? That is for that. And also I tell them a little bit more to help them go faster. We have to have some teamwork out there, work with other people, and that helps us go faster. <laughs> well, we love teamwork. Yes, we do. <laughs> what is your favorite part about being a spotter? I have the best seat in the house. I'm the highest and I get to watch the whole race from the beginning to the end. Oh, check out awesome. this view. Yeah, it sounds so fun. Whoa. Would you guys like to try it? 
Yeah, I have an idea. Okay. You'll be the spotter and I'll be the driver. That's a great idea. And you can be a fan cheering in the stands. Okay, <laughs> give us your best cheer and I'm gonna try to be the best spotter Let's I can be. Let's buckle up, click, Okay, <laughs> Mika, go really fast, okay? Here we go. <laughs> Time to see what we can see. Yes. Okay. Lead the way, Blippi. You're doing great. Keep it going. Watch your inside. Oh, a car's coming up on your outside. Whoa. Here we go. He's too back. He's too back. Whoa. Wait a minute. Mika, huh? you're doing great. Okay. Keep going. Mika, I think I see a dinosaur on the a track. dinosaur. Oh, no. Oh, no. Get out the way. His tail is right behind you. <laughs> yeah. And oh. you made it to the Yay. finish line. Thanks, Matt. Yeah. Great job, guys. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> that oh. was fun. And Brandon, have you seen a lot of dinosaurs on the racetrack? No, I look every race, but I've never seen one yet, but maybe oh. someday. Maybe someday. <laughs> well, thank you so much for teaching us all about being a spotter. You're welcome. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Bye. Nice to meet you guys. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa, it's race car driver Amber Bolka. Yeah. Oh, it's good to see you, Amber. It's so good Hi, to see Amber. you too. Yeah. We're learning about jobs today on the racetrack. Amazing. Well, my job is racing cars, which is my absolute dream job. Oh, yeah. Racing cars and being a driver sounds so fun. And yeah. who's this? This is my crew chief, Dave. Oh, hi, Dave. I'm hey, Dave. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. Nice ya. to meet you. <laughs> oh, and so you're a crew chief. What does a crew chief do? Well, I'm in charge of making sure the car is safe and fast. Whoa, you definitely want to be safe and you definitely want to be fast. <laughs> oh, well, what kind of things do you do when you have a pit stop? Yeah. Okay, so when we come in for a pit stop, we have, we have a jack man. He runs the jack. Whoa. And he pumps his jack and it jacks the car out. Whoa, check it out. The car is going up really high. <laughs> okay, so when the car is up, we have a tire changer. He comes and he, take, he takes these five lug nuts off. Okay. Pulls this tire off and he puts a brand new tire. Whoa, and then he probably puts those five lug nuts back on. Absolutely One, correct. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Absolutely. Whoa. You always want fresh tires. <laughs> and then the other thing we can do is we have this hole on this side in the back window and we have one on the other side we can adjust the race car to make it more comfortable for amber Whoa. to make it faster mika do you see these little holes yeah oh that's so, so cool oh that's pretty neat uh is there anything else a pit you do on a pit stop we also put gas in oh let's go check that out come on <laughs> so they're right now they're getting ready to put gas gas in the car Oh, cool. Do you see that big red gas tank? Yeah, that's really, really heavy. But it's what holds all the gas so that there's fuel in the car for the race. Oh, he looks strong. Yeah. Hey, that, gas, that gas can weighs about 100 pounds. Whoa, that's heavy. <laughs> you have to be really strong to be in the pit crew. And then when the jack goes back down to the ground, that's Amber's signal to mash the gas and leave pit road. Whoa, I have a question. Yes. What's the fastest NASCAR pit stop? It's under nine seconds. Under nine seconds, that's yep. so fast. Whoa, that's <laughs> so fast. Fat, fast cars and fast pit stops. Whoa. <laughs> Thank you, Amber. You're Thank welcome. you, Dave. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Thank you so much for teaching us all about pit crews and racing. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Okay, Bye, enjoy guys. your day. Whoa. <laughs> you too. <laughs> Whoa, Mika, that was so much fun learning about the pit crew. Yeah. <laughs> hey, let's try changing this tire. Yeah, we can try out some of these jobs for ourselves. <laughs> yes. oh, but what tool should we use to change out this tire? Hey, how about that twerk drill? Oh, yeah, <laughs> we can use this. Ooh. And remember, if you ever need something that requires a drill or yeah. a power tool, make sure you ask a grown-up for help. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, We'll friend. set it on loose and start taking off these bolts. Here we go. <laughs> Count them with me. Ah, One, ah, two, ah, three, ah, four. Can I do the last one? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> ah, five. five. <laughs> okay, now we need to put a new tire on this car. Okay, I'm on it. Woo. <laughs> Good job. Thank you. Oh, but now we need to tighten up these bolts. Yeah. Mika, would you like to try? Sure, we gotta give our driver back on the road. Oh, and remember, when we tighten the bolts, we wanna do it in a star pattern, so uh -huh. it's nice and even around the tire. Okay. One, two, three, four, 
five. Just like a twinkle, twinkle, little star. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> ah! Whoa. Whoa. Nice. Okay. Whoa, Mika, you're really good with that torque drill. Thank you, pal. <laughs> oh, the clock is ticking. We gotta be fast. Whoa, yeah. I think we took a little longer. But did you know the fastest tire change ever was nine seconds? Whoa, that's really fast. Yeah, really fast. I think we need a little more practice, though. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, maybe we can find some new jobs to learn about. Okay, let's go. <laughs> well, Mika, this race car is really colorful. <laughs> yes! Oh. Race cars are usually decorated with decals. Oh, yeah. Those are just like really big stickers. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I don't have any stickers. We can color this one. Oh, really? With markers from my jam pack. Whoa! <laughs> Do you mind if I borrow some? Sure, friend. That's what I brought them for. Whoa, look. Blue and green and purple. Black and red. Oh, okay. Let's get to coloring. <laughs> okay. What are you going to draw, Mika? A strawberry. A strawberry? Well, yeah. I'm going to draw... Hmm. Let's see what I'll draw. What is that? Hmm. A circle? It's just oval. Uh-huh. And then I'm going to draw... A jelly bean? Hey, you're pretty close. <laughs> it's a flying saucer. Ooh. Oh, cool. Whoa. May I borrow your green, please? Yes, there Here, you go. You can have the red. Oh, well, yeah, I'm gonna color in my UFO with some red. <laughs> Woo! Yum, that looks delicious. Woo. And I'll put my name, too. <laughs> Whoa, I love your strawberry. Would you like some? Yeah, and I think something that would be great to draw next to your strawberry what? is a cute little Blueberry! Yeah! Yeah, I'm giving it some stripes. That's so <laughs> cute, Blippi! Oh, and I better write my name next to yours. Huh? Okay, can yeah. I borrow all the purple? Yeah! I'm gonna add some grapes to our fruit salad. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna write my name in red for fun. <laughs> Here we go. Mika, this is pretty fun. We drew some pretty pictures and some very colorful fruits. Yeah. Maybe we can just draw some colors. Okay. Yeah, here we go. Whoa, coloring is really fun. <laughs> well, but remember, this is a car that's supposed to be colored. You don't want to draw on any old ordinary car. Only if you have permission. That's not very polite. Mm -mm, not polite at all. <laughs> well, here are all your markers back. Here we go. I'll load them up into my jam pack. And I think we should keep exploring and see if we can learn about some new jobs. Yeah, I'd love that. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa, that was so cool learning about all these jobs. And now that we learned all the jobs, it's time to do all the jobs. <laughs> Would you like to race first? Yeah, thanks, okay, Mika. Grant, of course. Okay, let me start the race with my flags. Oh, and I'm gonna get into the driver's seat and get all ready to go. Okay. Starting my engine. Start Whoa. those engines. On your mark, get set, go! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> okay, now I'll be the spotter. Hey, Blippi, swerve to your right. Whoa! Mika, okay. how am I doing? Awesome! Okay, get behind a driver so we can go faster. Okay. Whoa, so fast! You're doing awesome! <laughs> oh, this is pretty fun. Okay, <laughs> time for a pit stop. Okay. Remember, we need new tires and some more gas. <laughs> okay, okay, five second pit stop. Here we go. <laughs> cool! Okay, Blippi, keep going. We're almost there. to the finish line, but now I think it's time for you to try being the driver and I'll do all the jobs. Okay. Here we go. Woo. Okay, first I'll start the race with some flags. Here we go. Woo. Here I go. <laughs> oh, the race has started. Uh-oh. Oh, I think I see some geese. There's a bunch of geese flying Whoa. near the track. Caution! Whoa! Caution! Whoa! Watch out for those birds. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Now it's time to be the spotter. Okay. 
Keep going. What Watch do your I inside. need to do? Watch your inside. Okay. Okay, speed up. There's a car two back. He's gonna pass you. You're fast. Yes. Keep, keep, keep on the gas. Here we go. Woohoo! Time for a pit stop. Okay. <laughs> well, her tires look okay, but we definitely want to fill up on gas. Yes, I need a fill up, please. Here we go. Thanks, pit crew. You're doing great. Full tank of gas. She's almost to the finish line. <laughs> Miko wins the race. <laughs> Where's my trophy? Your trophy? Uh -oh. It's right here. <gasps> Yay! The Mika trophy! <laughs> oh, and the Blippi trophy. <gasps> Whoa, great teamwork! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun learning about different jobs today and seeing those huge tires! <laughs> And it was really cool learning that a pit stop is where a car stops for a quick fix. Yeah, and the fastest one was nine seconds. Yeah, and the pit crew are the fixer-uppers. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of our videos, all you have to do is search for our names. <laughs> oh, can you spell our names with us? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy, good job. <laughs> Will you spell my name with us? M E E K A H Mika. Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you soon, and I'll see you, Mika, at the finish line. Woo! Woo! So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Mika! <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika, and today we're at Posh and Petite Playhouse in Woodland Hills, California. <laughs> Did you know this is a place where we can explore and be curious about different jobs? <laughs> I can't wait to try different jobs like an ice cream maker or a firefighter. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Which way should we go? Oh, check out this road. <laughs> Look, it's black with white stripes. Oh, black and white are opposite colors. Opposites mean they're completely different from one another. Kind of like, oh, night and day, or hot and cold. <laughs> oh, check it out. Do you see that horse over there? Oh, let's drive our car over to him. <laughs> Hello, horsey. <laughs> I'm gonna name him Popsicle, cause I really love Popsicle. <laughs> Can you pretend to be a horse? <gasps> Nay! Whoa! Oh, he's got a lot of horsepower. Let's go! <laughs> Check it out, it's a marketplace. We can buy healthy fruits and vegetables here and make delicious meals. I know, let's be a grocer. <laughs> All right, see you later, Popsicle. First, we need our basket. <laughs> oh, wow, check it out. If we wanna be a grocer, we have to get some items to put in our basket so we can ring it up. <laughs> First, we'll need some alphabet soup. That's healthy and delicious. And how about some peas and carrots? And, ooh, mushrooms too. Check out all these healthy fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are good for your body because they help you grow strong. <laughs> I got it. Let's play a game. Fruit or vegetable? A carrot. It's orange and crunchy and bunny rabbits love to eat them. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> Do you know if this is a fruit or a vegetable? Oh, that's right, a vegetable. Great job. All right, how about this? It's a cucumber. It's green and it has seeds. Fruits have seeds and vegetables don't. Fruit or vegetable? 
<laughs> oh yeah, that's a tricky one. It's a fruit, even though it seems like it's a vegetable. But great job. Hmm. Oh, yum. A strawberry. Strawberries are really, really sweet. Is a strawberry a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> awesome. A fruit. One fruit point, please. Hmm. Oh, look. A lemon. Lemons are one of my favorite colors. Yellow. And they're really sour. Can you pretend to taste a sour lemon? <laughs> Whoa! Oh, sour is the opposite of sweet. Strawberries are sweet, but lemons are sour. Is this a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a fruit, just like the sweet strawberry. Okay, ooh, check it out, a piece of corn. Mmm, <gasps> that's delicious. Do you know if it's a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a yummy vegetable. All right, let's go check out now. Welcome to Mika's Marketplace. Oh, I see you got corn. And you're in luck, because we have a special on corn. Just one cent. And a lemon. And our sweet strawberry. And a delicious carrot. And alphabet soup, peas and carrots. Mmm, mushrooms. Wow, you got so many healthy options. <laughs> oh, being a grocer is so much fun. We even got to help a customer take home delicious vegetables to make yummy meals. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Yeehaw! Hey, we're at an ice cream shop. I know, let's pretend to be ice cream makers. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Let's go! Welcome to Mika's Magical Ice Cream Parlor. What's that? Fresh baked cookies? <laughs> Coming right up. Look at that, fresh out the oven. Oh, they smell delicious. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve crispy cookies. Let's taste one. Mmm, that's delicious. Would you like a bite? <laughs> there you go. Mmm. <laughs> Do you know what this is? That's right, a purple popsicle, just like my horse's name. <laughs> Would you like a popsicle? There you are, one for you and one for me. Oh, that's really cold. Perfect for a hot day. Oh, those are opposites. Hot and cold. When I'm cold, oh, it makes me shiver. But when I'm hot, oh, I could sure use a popsicle. <laughs> Would you like some ice cream today? Great. How many scoops? Oh, five scoops? Okay, here we go. One chocolate scoop. Two, a vanilla scoop. Three, mint chocolate chip. <laughs> there you go, friend. Perfect. Four, a strawberry scoop. And five, a vanilla scoop on top. <laughs> wow, it's stacked up so high. Mm. <laughs> I love being an ice cream maker. I love scooping ice cream and tasting it too. Hey, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> okay, let's see what other jobs we can do. <gasps> oh, don't forget Popsicle. Hello, Popsicle. Are you ready? Are you set? Go! <gasps> 
Wow, check it out. We're in front of a fire station. A firefighter's job is to put out fires. Do you want to be a firefighter with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. This is a cool fire station. Oh, look, a fire truck. It's red and really long too. <laughs> and look at these trucks. Let's go park. All right, to the parking lot we go. <laughs> oh, and look at these trucks. They're really big. Oh, and these trucks are small. Big and small, those are opposites. How about this one? Big or small compared to this truck? Pretty small, right? <laughs> but what about compared to this one? Oh, now it's really big. <laughs> Do you hear that? It's a siren. Oh, we gotta get ready to go. Put out a fire. Hello? Yes, fire? On one, two, three, fire road? Oh no! Let's go! Grab our hose! <gasps> Firefighter Mika is on the way! Grab my hose and save the day! Oh, awesome! We just put out a fire! Oh, <laughs> that was so much fun! Thanks for helping me, you're very brave. Firefighters are really brave. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Whoa, look, an animal hospital. This is where veterinarians work. Veterinarians are doctors, but for animals. Would you like to be a veterinarian with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. <laughs> oh, look at these doors. A small door for turtles and hamsters and gerbils too, and a medium door for bunny rabbits and ducks, quack quack, and ferrets and guinea pigs too. And a large door for cats and dogs. Large and small, those are opposites. <laughs> cool. Oh, and look at this door for birdies. Oh, that's another opposite. High and low, low and high. <laughs> Let's pretend to be birds fly into the vet's office. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> oh, do you hear that? Paging Dr. Mika, you have a patient ready. Okay. Oh, and check it out, here's our patient. Hello, puppy, how are you today? Little scratches, scratches. Did your family bring you here for a checkup? Oh, awesome. All right, let's get started, boy. We have a stethoscope. Stethoscopes are for hearing what's inside of your body, like your heart. Oh, may I check your heart too? Great. Wow, that sounds nice and strong. Okay, let's check puppy's heart. This might be a little cold. Wow, that sounds so healthy and strong. You must be getting on your daily walks, huh? Don't forget to hydrate, okay? Doctor's orders. <laughs> oh, being a veterinarian is so much fun. I love helping animals and their families too. <laughs> Now that I checked out the whole town, I'm gonna hit the road. Are you ready, Popsicle? <laughs> Let's go, giddy up! <laughs> Thank you so much for exploring different jobs with me today. <laughs> if I had to choose, I'd be a ice cream maker, grocer, animal doctor, firefighter. <laughs> all at once. <laughs> they were all so much fun, I can't just pick one. <laughs> but you know the best part? 
exploring with you, friend. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Oh, great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika! <laughs> okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at the Children's Creativity Museum in San Francisco, California. Do you know what creativity is? It's when you use your imagination to make anything. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Mission control. I'm ready to explore. Whoa, smooth landing. <laughs> Did you see? I was a rocket ship. <laughs> hey, look at these cool blocks. They're so colorful. Oh, and they feel soft. Do you know what shape this is? This is a rectangle. See, there's two short sides and two long sides. Yeah, do you know what color it is? Green, that's right. And look at all the little circles. Ah, these are really cool. Ooh, one of my favorite colors. Yellow. Hey, what if we built a rocket ship out of these blocks? All right, let's do it. Maybe this one and this one. Mm-hmm. And we need some wings. Which block would make a good wing? <gasps> this one. And maybe this one. Hmm. Maybe some yellow on the top. Yellow, it's nice and bright. This way, space knows we're coming. <laughs> and then maybe this. Whoa. Yes. It's time to launch this rocket ship into space. Count down with me from 10, ready? 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! <gasps> We've landed in space. There's no gravity. This is why I'm walking like this. Floating because I'm astronaut Mika. Whoa. One small step for inspiration. One giant leap for creativity. <laughs> Whoa. Look at all these moon rocks. We have to hop over them. Will you hop with me? Okay. Nice hopping. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. There's more to create. Let's go! Creativity installed. Oh, it says launch it. You must be able to launch things here. Huh. <gasps> this is a vertical wind tunnel. Yeah, this wind down here forces things to go up through the tunnel. This is a great way to test gravity. Do you know what gravity is? It's the force that pulls everything on Earth to the ground. It's also what keeps the planets orbiting the sun. Without gravity, they would just be floating around in space, like, like this. Whoa! Whoa! Where's gravity? <laughs> hey, looks like there's some items here that we could test to see which ones will float up through the tunnel. It's time for sink or fly. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, look. There's some leaves and flowers. They look really light. Do you think that they'll float up through the tunnel? Only one way to find out. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. Three, two, one. It went all the way up out of the tunnel and here it comes. Ooh, ooh. I caught it. I'm gonna see if it'll go up again. Okay. Ready? Goodbye, little leaf. Whoa, that's so cool. What else is in here? Oh. 
<laughs> Look at this squishy ball. <laughs> I wonder if this will float up the tunnel. What do you think? It's a little heavier than the leaf. All right, let's try. Three, two, one. Nope. <laughs> I think it's too heavy. Oh, look, there's some cotton balls here. See, they're green and soft. They also feel pretty light. Should we try? Maybe we can try both of them at the same time. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. It didn't fly up, but did you see it twirling around? Let's try again. Whoa, nope. <laughs> All right. <gasps> hey, this kind of looks like my bow. Twins. <laughs> this is pretty light too. Do you think it's gonna go up the tunnel? Let's try. <gasps> oh, just went up a little bit. Let's try it again. <gasps> Whoa, that was so cool. What about this? Ooh, this is so pretty. This piece of fabric, yeah. It looks light and floaty. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna let go, ready? Three, two, one. <gasps> Can I catch it? Got it, that was a fun one. I wanna do it again. <gasps> Three, two, one. Blast off! Wow, so it seems like the items that are really light go straight up out of the tunnel. And then the items that are kind of heavy stay towards the bottom or they don't float at all. What about this streamer? You might see this at a birthday party as a decoration, but have you seen a streamer and a vertical wind tunnel? Woo! Ready, set, go! Whoa! Can I catch it? Can I catch it? Got it. <laughs> Gravity is so awesome. Should we pretend to walk like there's no gravity? Okay, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's no gravity. <laughs> huh, I wonder what's going on with this wall. I see some tubes and pipes and this looks like a track and, oh, look, there's a magnet on the side and it sticks to the wall because it's magnetic. Cool. I have a great idea. Let's make a comet run. Do you know what a comet is? It's made of frozen space dust and rock and ice and the closer it is to the sun, the faster it travels because of gravity. So, we could say that this ball is the sun. Ooh, it's so hot, it's hot. Okay, sun, you stay there. And now, I need to make a comet run. So I'm gonna move some of these pieces so that the ball can travel towards the sun. So let's see, maybe move this down like this. What do you think? All right, now, which ball should be the comet? <gasps> what about this one? One of my favorite colors, purple. Okay, do you wanna be the comet? Great. Okay, you got this. You have to travel so fast towards the sun. You ready? All right, three, two, one. Go! Whoa! That was amazing! Did you see how fast it traveled? Let's try another one. Maybe this yellow one. One of my other favorite colors. <laughs> okay. Focus on the sun and travel as fast as you can. You got this. Three, two, one, go! Whoa! Oh, that one fell off. 
Maybe we should try the purple one again. All right. There's the sun. Travel so, so fast. Three, two, one, go! Yeah! That was amazing! This calls for a 10 second dance party. Dance it out with me! Hey, let's go explore some more. even have a space up on the rooftop outside where you can be creative. Look at all of this art. <laughs> Whoa, these are doors. Hello. <laughs> they painted them. Oh, look, a little green squiggly line and someone painted a heart. Oh, cool. Whoa, this structure kind of reminds me of a rocket ship. Three, two, one, <gasps> blast off. Hey, they have a smock. That means that I could paint something. Yeah, it's good to wear a smock. Then you can protect your clothes from the paint. <laughs> I'm feeling so inspired. What should I paint? Maybe something in space? I will paint. <sighs> Maybe you can guess. Do you know what planet we live on? Yeah, Earth. So I'm going to use, you know this color? Blue, yeah, blue, like the sky, the ocean. Whoa, I'll make a big circle for our planet Earth. Round and around and around. So there's so much water on Earth and there's a lot of land. So maybe I'll use green too. <gasps> yes, here's green right here. See green like trees or like a delicious avocado. <laughs> we'll put some green on here too. Oh, okay, there's earth. And then I think I'm gonna paint some white stars too. Hey. Did you know that there's over 100 billion stars in our galaxy? And that our galaxy is called the Milky Way. <laughs> we'll just do some stars like this all over. What do you think? I like it a lot. <laughs> wow. Well, I'll let that dry for now. <laughs> I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. We got so inspired and we used our creativity and our imagination. <gasps> Remember when we learned about comets and how they're made of frozen space dust? <laughs> I think that's so neat. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And I'm so excited because today we get to meet someone very special, Sean Johnson. <laughs> John is an Olympic gold medal gymnast. Gymnastics is a cool sport where you get to do lots of fun things with your body. It takes a lot of practice, strength, flexibility. <laughs> and Sean is going to show us some cool moves at the Nashville Gymnastics Training Center. I can't hardly wait. Woohoo! Here we go. Woo! <gasps> Oh, hi. <laughs> hey, Sean, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. It's so great to meet you. <laughs> you too. Will you show us some gymnastics? I would love to, but first we need to stretch and warm up to stay safe. Oh, right, because yes. first things first, safety first. Yes. So let's stretch your arms first, just kind All of right. across. Arms first. Yes. <laughs> How old were you when you started doing gymnastics? I actually started gymnastics when I was two years old. Whoa. I came into the gym and I just got to run around and I loved it. Oh, that sounds so yes. fun. Yes, it's kind <laughs> of like 
a playground, mm -hmm. but it's really soft and cushy, so you can do a lot of flips and stuff and stay safe. Oh, that's so yes. important. Let's stretch our legs next, right okay, here. Sure. So grab the back. It takes some balance, though. So. Whoa, you're really good at balancing. Yes, How a lot of practice. Yes, how often did you practice? So when I started at the age of two, I only went for like one hour, one time a week. But as I got older and I got better at it, I kind of went more and more hours. Wow. Because um, it takes a lot of practice to go to the Olympics. It really does. Yes. Yeah. And how many Olympic medals do you have? I have four Olympic medals. Oh. I have a gold on the balance beam and I have a silver on the floor and on the team, and on the all-around. Whoa! <laughs> yes. What are the differences between the medal colors? Yes, so the gold is number one. It's like the first place. And silver <laughs> is number two, second place. Nice. Yes. And then there's another one too, right? There's a bronze, which is third place. And did you ever lose? I did, a lot. I lost a lot of competitions, but I actually liked it better. Whenever I would make mistakes, it was so rewarding to come back into the gym and work on it and get better and like feel good inside. Oh, yes. Yeah. It's okay if you make mistakes. It's just an opportunity for growth. Yes. Okay, so let's sit down a little bit and stretch a little bit more before we get started. Okay. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Oh, it's okay to be nervous. I get nervous a lot. You do? Yes. What do you do when you get nervous? I practice so that I feel more confident. I trust myself and I say, I can do this. Mm. And I ask my coach if I'm ready. I can do this. Yeah. <laughs> now lean forward a little bit. Put your feet out in front of you. And touch your toes. Touch those toes. <laughs> I do think we're ready to get started. Oh, yay. Are you excited? I'm so excited. Okay, let's go do it. Here we go. <laughs> Can you teach me something on the beam? I can, but first we're gonna start on the low beam and progressively work our way here. Great idea. Okay. Progressively <laughs> means we take it one step at a time. Yes. Until you feel comfortable and much better. So we're gonna start at this end of the beam. Okay. <laughs> and you're gonna step up here. Okay, here I go. So the key to gymnastics is keeping all of your muscles squeezed as tight as possible. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. That helps us not fall off the beam. Right. If you do fall off the beam, it's okay. We'll right. just get back up and try again. Do you ever fall? I fall a lot. But with practice, you get more confident and better at your skills, so you fall less. Right. Okay, so arms will go straight out to the side. Yep. You can, I think you got this one. Oh, thanks. Sure. You're gonna kind of look right down at the beam to mm -hmm. make sure you walk in a straight line. Okay. And we're just gonna walk forward. Okay. Walk one, two, two, three, three, four, four. Okay, nice. now we're gonna walk backwards. Oh, that sounds tricky. So the thing with this is you're gonna feel for the beam and then plant your foot. Make sure you look down. Feel for the beam, for the plant. Beam. And you're gonna go back till you feel the end of the beam. Okay. And when you feel the end, you're gonna stop. Okay. Keep going, <laughs> keep feeling. Keep feeling. <gasps> there you are. Yay, I made it to the stop. end. <laughs> so now we're gonna do flamingo walk. Okay. You're flamingo. gonna take a step. Hmm. Flamingo. Flamingo. Step. Flamingo. Ska, ska. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there flamingo. we go. Step, flamingo. Step, flamingo. Now in gymnastics, we yes. always like to be barefoot uh -huh. because being able to feel the beam with our bare feet helps us have more control. It's Probably safer. Probably makes it less slippery too. Yes. So one more. Flamingo. Good job. <laughs> okay, next skill, we're gonna try a scale. Uh-huh. I don't know why they call it this, but it's just the name. You're gonna take your dominant side, which is usually the same side of your body you write with. My right hand side. Yes, and for some reason, I think one side of your body is just usually stronger. So we Ooh. favor that in gymnastics. Okay. So you take your dominant side, mm -hmm. lean forward, arms out, and scale down. Whoa! And scale back up. Scale down. <gasps> and scale back up. Good job! <laughs> that takes a lot of strength and a lot of balance. Mm-hmm. Okay, last one, are you ready? I'm ready. 
So with this one, we're actually gonna do a jump. <gasps> Whoa. Now, for all the kids watching, make sure you always have a coach with you and you don't do anything your coach doesn't say is safe for you. Okay. Okay. Is but it I safe, think you're Sean? ready. I think you're ready okay. for this. Coach says we're ready. <laughs> so when you jump, you wanna squeeze all your muscles super tight. You're gonna go down, jump, down. So okay. bend, straight, bend. And squeeze all those muscles together. Okay. Make sure you look at the beam too. There we go. Ready? Here we go. Whoa! It's okay. We can try it again. Count to ten and try again. <gasps> Will you count to ten with us? Oh, great. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And okay. try again. Okay, here we go. Remember, squeeze your muscles, mm -hmm. squeeze all everything together, and I think you got this one by yourself. Are you ready? Okay. Make sure you look at the beam. Ready, one, two, two three. three. Good job! Yeah. <laughs> okay, I think you're ready for the big beam. <gasps> okay, let's try the big beam. Let's go. So, with the big beam, I personally think the hardest part is just climbing up. So I'll help you climb up, and then I can hold your hand through the whole thing. Okay, it's really tall. I know. But it might feel tall, but nothing's changed. It's the same beam as down there, mm -hmm. and you are so confident and strong, I know you can do it up here. Thanks, Dad. Let's do it. <laughs> this is tricky. Whoa! Does it feel a little higher? Yeah, I feel a little nervous. Okay, remember, tell yourself, I can do this, take a deep breath, and know that your coach, myself, <laughs> believes you can do it too. I can do this. <sighs> deep breaths. And make sure if you're at home, you don't try any of this without a coach or without a gym, because safety is definitely first. Mm -hmm. Most Good important. Job. Okay, you've kind of mastered the forward walking. Let's try the backward. Okay. <laughs> okay, look at the beam, squeeze all your muscles, feel, feel your behind you and plant your foot. <laughs> Good job. Good job, let's take two more steps. Okay, one, one <gasps> two. two. Okay, are you ready for your flamingos? Yes. Okay, let's try four this time. Four flamingos. Yeah. Here we go. One, two, three, four flamingos. Good job. Splash, splash, splash. Hey. Are you ready for your jump? I'm ready. Okay, so Whoa. here, I'm actually gonna get on the beam with you and okay. help you with your jump. So, what we're gonna do, I'll show you, you feel my hands. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do a small jump, keep every muscle really tight, just like that. I'm gonna hold your hands, you use me for balance. You're gonna squeeze everything together, go down, jump, down, and you're good. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Okay, make sure you look at the beam. Ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Whoa! Good job! <laughs> that was really good. That was fun. You wanna try one more? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, three. <gasps> good job! Whoa! I'm so proud of you. Oh, I think you've so. mastered the beam. Do you wanna go to the floor? Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that beam was so fun! I was so proud of you. You did such a good job. Oh, thank you, Sean. <laughs> and the medal goes to... <gasps> Mika! <laughs> so, now that we're on the floor, I thought I could teach you another new skill. Oh, great! But first, can you do a cartwheel? Oh, yes. I love doing cartwheels. Do you mind showing me your cartwheel? I'd be happy to. Okay, let's see it. <laughs> That's a really good cartwheel. Oh, thank Since you, you already know how to do a cartwheel, mm -hmm. how about we take the next step and we learn a round off? Sounds great, a okay. round off? A round off is like a cartwheel, but instead of landing one foot at a time, you put your feet together. Whoa. Yeah, it's a foundational skill in gymnastics that you learn before you learn all the big flips, like flips and tricks. Oh, yes, yeah. that sounds great. Okay, so I'll show you first. Uh huh. The cartwheel, just like you did, is pretty simple like this. Mm -hmm. One foot after another. So what you're going to do is, when you're upside down, your uh -huh. feet will come together and land together. Kind of like this. Whoa! <laughs> and 
This might sound silly, but the floor, you wanna push it away as hard as you can. Okay. That's what kind of gives you that speed to kind of jump off the floor. All right. Okay, are you ready to try one? Sure. Let's I'll give, give it, it a, a shot. It's okay if we make mistakes, we'll work on it. That's true, that's what I learned on the beam. Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, here I go. Whoa. <laughs> Good job, good job. So we also want to try to keep our legs as straight as we can. Okay. And a little trick for that is if you point your toes as hard as you can, your legs will naturally straighten. Really? Yeah. Okay. Let's try one more time. Sure. That was a lot better. Oh, Yay. Good. I'm so proud of you again. That's another <laughs> new skill. Thank you so much, Dad. Of course. That was awesome. Good job. <laughs> Do you think I could do that someday? I think with a lot of practice and hard work, you definitely could. Oh, thank you for showing me all those skills. You did such a good job on the beam, on the floor. I was really proud of you. Oh, yeah. We had such a busy day today. We learned how to do <gasps> balancing walks on the beam and scales. Wow. <laughs> and we learned how to do a round off at the end of our cartwheels. Yeah. Oh, we also learned that there's a side of your body that's usually stronger than the other side. Yeah, and that's the side we usually use in gymnastics. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Can you spell my name with me? S H A. W-N, Sean! <laughs> Bye, friends! Oh, I'd like to keep practicing, please. Me too. <laughs>
Hey, there's a flower nearby with lots of pollen. Right, Bila? <laughs> oh, that's right. Awesome job, class. <laughs> All right, class, for my next scientific exploration, I'm going to make Bila a beehive. Oh, I can use these cool shapes. Hmm, whoa, this could be a, maybe a slide for the bees. And whoa, these are kind of cool. Maybe I could use those. And oh, these circles will be the perfect honeycombs. <laughs> yeah, okay, I have a plan and I'm ready to get started. made you a throne, so you can be Queen Bila. You can sit there. <laughs> Is it comfy? Yes. <laughs> and look, buzz, I made you a slide. Ready? I'll hold your hand on the way down. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, class, what should we learn about next? I know, I'll give you a hint. <laughs> One, two, three. That's right, our next subject is math. <laughs> Here we go. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> math is learning about numbers and shapes. Okay, class, are you ready for your math lesson? Okay, take your seats. And get out your pencils. All right, first, let's count the cars. Ready? Will you count with me? Oh, great, you're such wonderful students. One, two, three, three cars. And a car has four wheels. Will you count the wheels with me? Okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Four wheels. Awesome job. <laughs> oh, and check it out. There are two more cars at the top. <gasps> Hey, let's count all of the cars. Ready, class? One, two, three, four, whoa, five. Five cars total. I have an idea. Let's race the two at the top. Come on, Vila. Wonderful day here at the Mini Speedway. A beautiful day for racing. All right, our drivers are all set and ready to go. On your mark, get set, start your engines. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, that was awesome. Great counting. <laughs> these mountains. Hey class, did you know that there are mountains deep down in the bottom of the ocean? <laughs> yeah, in fact, some islands are actually the tops or peaks of mountains. Oh, what do you think? Should I climb up way to the top of this mountain? <gasps> I'm a little nervous. Okay, let's give it a try. Hey, we can count the steps on our way. Here we go. Ready, Vila? Buzz. <laughs> Here we go. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Getting higher. Five. 
five, six, seven. Whoa! I can see the valley down below. Eight, nine, ten. Ten steps to the top. Hey, speaking of ten, this calls for a ten second dance break. Ready, Vila? We did it. We did it. We never ever quit it. We did it. Oh, and check it out. There's a slide. Let's go down the slide. Whee! Woohoo! <laughs> hey, there's another slide. We should definitely go down. But first, let's put a flag to say that we've been to the top. Da 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 da! I know. I'll name this mountain Mika's Majestic Mountain Top. All right, let's go down. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, what's that, Vila? Oh, Vila would like to do a dance too. Okay, Vila, hit it. Waggle and shake. Buzz, 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 dance break. <laughs> Great job, Vila. Art is when you use your imagination and creativity through painting and writing music, and so much more. Whoa, check out this amazing art gallery. There are so many colorful creations. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> Hello. Oh, this looks like some curly colorful hair. Awesome. Oh, and look. Bah, bah. Wow, I like this tissue paper for hair. That's so creative. Now that I have some inspiration from the art gallery, I think I know what I want to create. Okay, sit right there and I'll draw you. Oh, but I need a marker. <laughs> there we go. Okay, first I'll start with your head. <laughs> and then we'll do your body. Oh, okay, I think I'm ready to glue your eyes. Whoa, this glue is so sticky. <laughs> Ooh, stars. Yeah, I definitely want some stars on there. I'll put it all over. What's that, Bila? <gasps> right! I need your antenna! Okay, I'm ready to cut you out. some of this scrap piece of paper to make some wings. Check it out, Vila. Look, <laughs> it's you. Yeah, looks pretty identical, I'd say. <laughs> okay, class, art dismissed. Let's buzz on out of here. <laughs> Whoa, we learned so much today. We had a busy, buzzy day. The class, now it's time for recess. <laughs> Are you ready to play? Yeah, me too. <gasps> hey, I see some fun over this way. <laughs> Come on, Vila. How to surf? Okay, I'll teach you how. Okay, first you want to swim out, paddle out deep into the ocean. And then when you feel the ocean push you forward, you want to hop up on your board 
Whoa! And balance! And ride the wave! <laughs> Hang ten! <laughs> okay, Bila, are you ready to give it a shot? Sure, Buzz! <laughs> okay, friend! Paddle out! Swim, swim, swim! Yay! Great job, Bila! Okay, do you feel the ocean push you forward? Hop up on your board! Yeah! Balance and ride that wave! <laughs> wow, Bila! That was epic! <laughs> Whoa! We did so much today! Teachers have such an important job because they teach their students lots of interesting facts. What did we learn today? One, two, three, can you tell me? <laughs> yeah, we learned that bees do a certain dance to pollinate. <gasps> oh, and we also learned so much about science and math and art. It was an awesome day and you're such a wonderful student. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Oh, great! <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika! Okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I'm up so high! Hello! I'm over Hello. here! Hello! There's a slide. I'll meet you at the bottom. Hi. Three, two, one. Yay. <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Twinkle Play Space in Brooklyn, New York. I'm so excited because there's lots of fun things to do here. Oh, look down here. This looks like something a doctor would use. Maybe to check your reflexes. Whoa. <laughs> I'll just put this in my jam pack. And a thermometer. Something else a doctor might use. Interesting. Hmm, a clipboard? Maybe a doctor clipboard? And a stethoscope. Yeah, this is something a doctor uses to check your heartbeat. <laughs> There's a note. Dear Mika. Pettenville needs someone to take care of its animal friends. Here is your veterinarian kit. I know you'll do a great job. Signed, Mayor Rooster. Oh, that's so cool. I get to take care of animals. That's what a veterinarian or a vet does. They're so important because they're animal doctors who take care of animals. Oh, look over here. A doctor's coat. Let's try it on. Wow! I look like a real animal doctor, huh? <laughs> oh, first on the list is a dragon. We better go find it. Come on. Whoa, check it out. A really big, cool looking dragon. Hi, dragon. Oh, it's a mama dragon. Look at the four dragon babies up there. Let's see what the problem is. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. What's the problem? Hey, I can't laugh. What? You can't laugh? Oh, that must be so frustrating. I love to laugh. Hmm, let me see if I can help. Let me just check your heartbeat. Dun dun, dun dun. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, I like that beat. Heartbeat sounds nice and strong. Hmm, what are some ways you can make someone laugh? Maybe some silly dance moves. Uh, okay, Mama Dragon, check this out. Nothing? Tough crowd. Hmm, well, maybe there's something wrong with your throat. I'll take these scarves. We'll go in here, up the dragon's throat, and out. Maybe that will tickle the dragon and the dragon can laugh. Let's try.
Did it work? Oh, oh! <laughs> oh, did you hear that? <laughs> She's laughing. Listen. <laughs> wow! Thank you, Dr. Mika. Oh, well, thank you for being a wonderful patient. <laughs> wow, we did it. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> Have fun laughing. Okay, next animal. Come on. Wow, what a beautiful tree. <gasps> Look, cute little birds. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you feeling today? Oh, they said they feel fine, but they need their checkup. Have you ever been to the doctor for a checkup? Yeah, just to make sure everything is good and nice and healthy. Come here, little bird. Oh, so sweet. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> okay, the first thing I'm gonna do is check your temperature. Okay, let's see, I think I have a thermometer in here. Yep, here it is. Just gonna put it under your wing. Stay still for me. Mm -hmm. Yes, perfect temperature. That's really good. Okay, let's see what else we can check here. How about your eyes? Look at me. Keep going. Look, there we go. All right. <gasps> nice. Ooh, healthy eyes. You must eat a lot of healthy food. All right, now we're just gonna check your brother over here. What healthy birds we have here. Keep up the good work, eat healthy and stay strong. Tweet, tweet, tweet. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. This is a vet's office. Animals can come here to get some extra care if maybe they're not feeling well or they're sick. Oh, look, this is a cool place to give an animal a bath, make it nice and clean. Oh, these are bird cages. Cool. Oh, don't see any birds in there though. Hmm. <gasps> I do see some animals over here. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at this little kitty cat. It's sleeping. Shh. <laughs> oh, this cat's awake. Hi, cat. Do you want to come out and say hi? Aw. Meow. Meow. Oh, how are you feeling? Much better. Oh, I'm so happy. Do you want to rest a little longer? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll put you back. Okay. Aw. There you go. Have a nice rest. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, it's a horse. Yay, yay. Hi horse, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you feeling today? Much better, yay. Oh good, <laughs> I'll put you back so you can rest too. Aw, <gasps> another sleeping animal. It's a little puppy. Look at its little nose. So cute. Did you know that dogs can smell really well? Yeah, they have wet noses. Have you ever noticed a dog's nose? If you touch it, it feels a little wet. Because smells stick better to wet noses than dry noses. And a dog could smell a human over 40 feet away, or about 12 meters. That's really, really far away. Isn't that cool? Oh, shit. Isn't that cool? <laughs> oh, do you know what animal this is? It's a rabbit! <laughs> Look at its long ears. Hello? <laughs> oh, I think this rabbit needs to rest too. There you go. Aw, all these animals are resting. It's really important to rest, especially if you don't feel very well. And look, a little pig. Oink, oink, oink. <laughs> look how cute. How are you feeling today, pig? Oh, that's great. The pig said it's feeling a lot better. Oh, good, I'm so glad. Well, everyone rest up, and I'm going to go look for some other animals who might need my care. You come with me? Let's go. Cool. We're on a farm! Wow, 
there's lots of farm animals in here. Huh. A chicken and little chicks. Hi. <laughs> They're so cute. <gasps> Three new patients. Let's see. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you? <coughs> oh, <laughs> I understand, cow. The cow is saying that it's feeling a little lonely. Aw, well, <laughs> looks like your x-ray is on the wall. Let's take a check. All right, looks like, uh-huh, correct, yep, that's the one, oh yeah. You look great, your x-ray is actually perfect. But you said you're lonely, hmm. You know, they say that cows have best friends. <laughs> yeah, they have a favorite cow that they like to hang out with all the time. So I bet you need a cow friend. Hmm, do you see any cows around here? Meow. Did you hear that? I think it's coming from inside. Oh yeah! Look at this sweet cow! Meow. Do you want a best friend? Meow. I have a great friend for you. Come on! Here you are! Best friends, best friends! Aww! <laughs> Do you feel better? No. <laughs> awesome, I'm so glad. Did you hear that? It sounded like a cat in trouble. Oh no, there's a cat stuck way up there. I have to save it, come on. Whoa, a fire truck. Ah, yeah, firefighters help cats get out of really high places all the time. Looks like I need to save a cat. Here we go! I'm coming for you, cat! Hi, cat! It's me, Dr. Mika! Let me see if I can get you unstuck. Oh, are you okay? Oh, well, I have you now. Let's go back down the ladder. How are you feeling? Oh, <gasps> there's a fire! I better become a firefighter and put it out! Close one. You know what? I think I'll take you to the vet's office and check your heartbeat and make sure you're a-okay. Come on. Meow. <laughs> okay, little cat. Welcome to my office. Let me just give your heartbeat one more listen, okay? All right. Make sure it's a nice, strong heartbeat. Okay, let's listen. Bum bum, bum bum, bum bum. Oh, sounds perfect. <laughs> nice, strong heartbeat. Okay, well, you've had a really long day, so I think maybe you should get some rest. What do you think? Yeah, I agree. Come on, let's see if there's any open spots for you to lay down and take it easy. All right, here you go. Get nice and cozy and take a little rest. It's important to get rest, especially when you're not feeling well. <laughs> well, I had so much fun today taking care of those animals. Thank you so much for your help. And isn't it cool that dogs can smell so well and that cows have best friends? <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Mika the Vet, out. <laughs> Bye. Whoa. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Ball and Bounce in Encino, California. I bet there's all different kinds of balls that bounce here. And I bet there's a lot of different shapes here too we can explore, like circles, or triangles, or squares, or rectangles. <laughs> Will you explore with me? Oh great, let's go. <laughs> Look how cool this floor is. I see a lot of different colors 
And I see a shape. Do you see a shape too? Yeah, a square. Here, come down here. A square has four sides. Let's count. One, two, three, four. There are squares all over this floor. Hmm, I know. I'm only gonna hop on the green squares. Ready? Green, green, green. Whoa, look at this. Do you know what this is? It's a basketball hoop. And I see basketballs on the wall. Will you count the basketballs with me? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six basketballs. <gasps> and I see four more right here. Wow, they're all different colors. There's one, two, three, four basketballs. Wow, these are so fun. Do you know what basketball is? It's a really fun sport. You take the basketball and you wanna get it in the basket or the hoop. <laughs> hmm, I wonder if I could get any of these balls in the hoop. I'm gonna try my best. Okay, here we go. Basketball star Mika going for the hoop. Oh, I missed it. That's okay, I'm gonna keep practicing. Now we're gonna try the green basketball. Oh, see, I was trying to use the backboard to help me get it in, and it still didn't work. Well, I have two balls left. The yellow basketball, maybe this is the one. <gasps> yeah, this calls for a 10 second dance party. Yeah! <laughs> Should I try the last one? Maybe this time I'll do a slam dunk. Ready? Here we go. Whoa! Wow! I got the skills. <laughs> I'm just being silly. <laughs> Can you think of another sport where you would need to use a ball? Hmm. <gasps> a soccer ball. Yeah, soccer is another really fun sport where you use a ball. I wonder if we can find a soccer goal anywhere. Come on. I found one, a soccer goal. We have our soccer ball and our soccer goal, so now we can really play soccer. <laughs> Check out the soccer ball. See, it's black and white, and there's two different shapes on it. This shape is a pentagon. Will you count the sides with me? Okay, one, two, three, four, five. A pentagon has five sides. And this shape is a hexagon. <laughs> Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six sides. So in soccer, you wanna get the ball into the goal, but you can't use your hands. You can use your feet, you can use your knees. Hmm, wait a second. There's more balls over here. I wonder if I can get all of them into the goal. Let's see. Oh, we saw something like this earlier. It's a tiny basketball. Do you know what color it is? That's right, it's orange. I'm gonna kick it in the goal. Here we go. Boop, <laughs> oh yeah, goal. And what? <laughs> this tiny one looks like a ball pit ball. Do you know what color that is? Yellow, <laughs> one of my favorites. Let's see if I can kick this tiny little ball into the goal. <gasps> Boop, yes, goal. And we have this really bouncy ball. And it's blue. All right, in you go. Yeah, whoa, that was a big one. Goal. And another basketball, but this one's a different color. Do you know what color it is? Red, oh right. That was too light of a kick, but don't worry, I have it in me. Here we go. Goal, see, I knew I could do it. 
And here's another really bouncy ball, and it's yellow. All right, three, two, one, go! Do you know what this color is? Oh yeah, it's red. Okay, go! <laughs> and now is the time for the official soccer kick. I'm using a soccer ball. I'm using a soccer goal. One, go! I love soccer. <laughs> Thanks so much for playing with me. Wonder what else is here to play with. Let's go. Hey, look at these colorful blocks. Huh, they're kind of set up like bowling pins. And bowling is another sport where you use a ball. There's usually 10 pins for bowling. Will you count with me? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is the perfect setup for bowling. The pins don't usually look like this. These are rectangles. Do you know what a rectangle is? It's a shape with four sides and it has two long sides and two short sides. Let's count them. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's a rectangle. Hmm, and usually you have a bowling ball, which is really heavy. <laughs> but I don't think there's any bowling balls here. Hey, but there's some balls over here. I wonder what kind of ball would knock these blocks over. Hmm, you could try, oh, <laughs> look at this little one. Do you know what color this is? Blue, yeah, let's see if it will knock over these blocks. Nope. <laughs> what about this one? This is a fun yellow ball. All right, let's see if this one will work. Whoa! <laughs> wow, that's a really bouncy ball. It bounced right off the pin. Let's see how many I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hey, that's pretty good. I'll set them back up. We can try another ball. Awesome. Ooh, what about this basketball? <laughs> I wonder if it's too bouncy to knock any of these blocks over. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> yep, I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> we have one ball left to try, the soccer ball. Let's see if the soccer ball can knock any blocks over. Okay. Here we go. Three, two, one. Wow, I knocked over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks. Hmm, I wonder what else we could do to knock these blocks down. I have an idea. What if instead of bowling, we played Mika Bowl? <laughs> And instead of using a ball, I'll use me. <laughs> okay, set these up, and I'm gonna find a way to go down and knock these blocks over. What can I do? I could dance, I could crawl, I could run, or I could be one of my favorite dinosaurs, a T-Rex. Are you ready for the Mika Bowl? Rawr. Oh, yeah, I did it. I knocked all the pins over. And in bowling, when that happens, it's called a strike. Strike! Five, six, seven, eight. And now it's time to celebrate. Come on, let's keep playing. Whoa, there are a lot of shapes here. <gasps> Come look at this one. This 
is an octagon. Do you know how many sides it has? Well, let's count and find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight sides. Wow, that's a really cool shape. Hmm. Oh, look at these little chairs. If you look at the back of them, you can see a square. A square has four sides, see? One, two, three, four. And there's one, two, three, four squares. But if you look even closer, when all of them are together, it makes one big rectangle. And makes for a really comfy couch. <laughs> Whoa, do you see this? It's a giant circle. Huh, it kind of looks like a cake or a pie. Whoa, whoa look at this big slice of cake. Mmm, mmm, mm -hmm. very tasty. <laughs> wow, there's more shapes over here. I see a big purple rectangle, see? Here's the two long sides and the two short sides. <laughs> oh, and if you look to the side here, I see a pink triangle. See, one, two, three. Do you see any other shapes? <gasps> yeah, a circle, a red circle. <laughs> and this ball's here too. Should I throw the ball through the circle? Okay, let's do it. All right, ready? So long, ball. Woo! <laughs> hey, I see some really special circles over there. Come on. Whoa, look at all of these bubbles. These are the cool circles that I was talking about. <laughs> bubbles are so fun. Hey, you know what I just realized? Every ball we played with today was a circle. A basketball, a soccer ball, a bouncy ball, a ball pit ball. <laughs> so many circles today. Can you remember any other shapes that we saw? We saw a hexagon, a pentagon, an octagon, a rectangle, a triangle, a square. <laughs> there are so many shapes all around us all the time. Isn't that cool? <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> cool. M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> well, I'm gonna keep playing with these bubbles. See you next time, bye. What, this is so cool. I can't believe I'm driving a real race car. Race car Mika coming down the track. Start your engines! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Mika for the win! <laughs> Look at this stadium! It's so big! Can you guess where I am today? <laughs> Daytona Beach, Florida at the Daytona International Speedway. Do you know what a big event takes place here? I'll give you a hint. <laughs> it's a world famous race with lots of fast cars. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Check out this track. That's where all the cars drive during the race. It's 2.5 miles long. That's about 400 school buses. It would take me 4,400 cartwheels to make it around the whole track. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. Here I go. Woo! One, two, three. That's a lot of cartwheels. I have an idea. <laughs> do you wanna go in the garage with me and see a lot of fast cars? Okay, buckle up. Click, click. Let's go! <gasps> Check it out! It's a real race car! Whoa! And look, 
It's one of my favorite colors, purple. <laughs> it matches me so well. I hope I get to drive a real race car later. But let's check out this car. Hey, there's some more colors up here. Yellow, red, and blue. Those are primary colors. And look, do you know what this number is? <laughs> yeah, it's number 23. Whoa! And look at these tires. Whoa! Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> it's a circle, round just like a bagel or a donut or the sun. <laughs> Do you want to pretend to be a race car driver with me? Okay, friend, buckle up. <gasps> See you later. <laughs> Whoa, it's Amber Balkin. Hey, Amber. Hi. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mika. <laughs> I hear you're the first Canadian female to win a NASCAR sanctioned race. That's true. Whoa. Do you have any other career accomplishments you're particularly proud of? Well, I hope to make history this weekend by becoming the first female to ever win an art national ARCA race. Whoa, good luck. Thank you. <laughs> How did you get into NASCAR driving? So I've actually been going to the racetrack since I've been in my mom's belly. So I've been at the racetrack for a long time. I actually got started in go-karts where most kids start racing. Wow, and what are your favorite things about being a driver? Well, I love going fast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's definitely my favorite. <laughs> How fast do you go? So this weekend we'll be going 183 mile an hour. Whoa, that's <laughs> so fast. It's very fast. How do you prepare for a race? Well, I make sure I drink lots of water, lots of good food. Mm -hmm. I train really hard during the week and make sure I study hard too. <laughs> You're very prepared, Amber. <laughs> Is that your car? Yeah, that's my race car. Do you want to see it? Yes, please. Okay. So Mika, this is my crew chief, Dave. He makes the car go really fast. Hey Dave, I'm Mika. I'm Dave, nice to meet you. <laughs> it takes a good team to be a race car driver, right? It does, it takes a lot of us. What is this tool you're using? This is a 916 wrench. It's one of the most common re wrenches we use on a race car. Whoa, can you make that sound again? <laughs> that sounds so cool. What other tools do you use? We have a jack. This is what we use to put the race car on the scale. Yeah. Hi, Jack. <laughs> we use the scales to weigh the car. We can we can change the weight on all four corners of the car at the tires oh. to make the car go faster and handle better. So we to and make my job easier. <laughs> oh yes, that's what a good team does. Yeah. <laughs> and how come there's no door? Okay, so we don't run a door. We have a door, but we don't have a door handle. Oh. The door doesn't open. It's just permanently affixed to the fender and in, in, in the quarter panel. How do you so get in? I actually get in by jumping through the window. Wow! Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Can you show me more of your car? Well, certainly. We have numbers to identify as we go around the racetrack. That helps me know when Amber's going by. It helps all the fans and, and friends to know this is Amber's race car. Whoa! Do you know what number that is? <laughs> yeah, number 15. <laughs> now, if you come around the car, you'll see they look Whoa. like lights, uh -huh. but they're just decals. Whoa. They actually don't work, but we give them the appearance that they're real. There are no blinkers There's in this There's no type blinkers of race. or no <laughs> brake lights or anything on a race car. They're just stickers? They're just stickers. Well, how do the other drivers know when you're going to stop? They don't. They don't. This is a spoiler. Uh-huh. Mom and Dad's car probably does not have a spoiler no, on I it. I haven't seen one of these before. But this spoiler gives a lot of downforce to give Amber a lot of comfort when she's going into the corner. Downforce? A lot of it makes a lot of pressure onto the four tires to hold the race car into the onto the racetrack. Oh, it wow. makes it go faster. Oh, <laughs> you love going fast. I love going fast. <laughs> is there any other way a race car is different from a regular car? Bodies are all fiberglass as opposed to metal. Okay. There's only one seat, so unfortunately I couldn't take you in my race car. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> and to keep her safe as we come around the race car, she has a radio in her car, but it's not a radio to listen to music. If someone breaks, uh -huh. 
he'll he'll say, uh oh, big crash up ahead. Oh. Watch out. And so that's when I know. Like Amber, Amber, look ahead. Yeah. Look ahead. Exactly. <laughs> that exactly. That is so cool, Dave. So to keep her safe, uh huh. She's got she's got her seat custom custom fit to her. But we don't have a window on the driver's side of the car. Oh, what's that? We have a window net. Oh, a window net. And what this, it, see, it looks just like a net. And this net goes up in here and it gets tight. It's to keep things from going in the car and, and hitting her, but allowing fresh air in, in, into the race car. Because it gets really hot in the race car. Oh, cars. I bet. To help keep her cool. Wow, that is incredible. Thank you so much for showing me your car. You're welcome. That was so cool. <laughs> Very welcome. Hey, do you see that ladder in that platform? <laughs> yeah, someone stands there during the race and waves these flags. Green means go! <laughs> Yellow means caution! Slow down! <laughs> Red means stop! <laughs> and the checkered flag means the race is over! <laughs> yeah! Okay, now that I've learned about the cars and the drivers and the track, I think I'm ready to try driving! Woo! Look! <laughs> it's the real race car I get to drive, number 43. But first thing first, Safety first. See you soon. Woohoo! I have my helmet and my safety suit, and I'm all ready to go. Are you ready? I know I am. Let's do it. Woo! This is going to be so cool. Steering wheel. I'm ready. I'm driving a real race car. Yeah! Vroom, vroom. Race car Mika coming down the track. <laughs> I can't believe how fast I'm going. Oh, whoa, this is so fast. <laughs> ah, whoa, that was amazing. Did you see me? I was going so fast! Woo! <laughs> that was one of the coolest things I've ever done! Whoa! <laughs> that was an awesome day! I loved climbing through the window and going so fast in a real race car. Meeting the pit crew was pretty cool too. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> Can you spell my name with me? Awesome. <gasps> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. OK, little race car drivers, see you later. Come on, everyone. Let's make a learning fun. Mika, Mika. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika. Mika.